Maybe it's a dream, maybe nothing else is real, but it wouldn't mean a thing if I told you how I feel. So I thought of all the pain, all the misery inside, when I wish that I could be feeling nothing but the night. Can you tell me what to say? You can tell me where to go, but I doubt that I would care, and my heart would never know. If you feel you know me, there'll be no one holding back, because everything will change, and it all will fade to black. Hi! We live! I'm gonna let this song play out before we head into the game. Because I love this song so much. This is literally my theme song. I've gotten now to see. I've forgotten if I can. If you open up my eyes, there'll be no more going then. Can I throw it all away and then I would paint it black? All right, it's good to see everybody here. It's so good to see everyone. So, uh, I got a new game. I got Muse Dash. This is a game that people keep telling me I should buy and play. So it's called Bad Apple. And the song's called Bad Apple. Yeah. Hi, Velveeta. How you doing? Gzoom is in call, uh, we, which will be open in just a moment. Surprise, he's not showing up. Are we in the wrong thing? I don't know. I'm surprised he's not showing up. Okay, let's go ahead and unmute. Hey, uh, Gzoom? Why, why are you not showing up here? Yeah, um. <laughs> why? Why? Yes. Why aren't you showing up on stream? Oh wow, that's a little loud. Huh. He's playing SnowRunner, but hey, baby, says uh, Velvita. Hey, goodie. Uh, so you guys want pics? I took a potion of invisibility, bro. Shit, why can't I? Where are you? Why aren't you showing up? That is odd. That's actually really odd. Let me just hide it and unhide it. Huh. Okay, so before we start, we gotta fix G Zoom. Yes. <laughs> fix me. Properties. He's not for your eyes, only mine. Uh, you all, oh, yeah, you. I do need to update your thing as well. Oh, what? To, you mean you mean to the fucking PNG I sent you like two Wait. weeks ago? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I've been forgetting. Yeah. <laughs> did, did you DM it to the, uh... It's in the PNG chat, I'm pretty sure. Fuck, that thing's way the fuck down. Yeah, there it is. I was like, hmm, let me make sure. To, uh, I was I was gonna remind you, and then I was like, "Eh, it's fine." <laughs> I do like the one I sent you first as well. So, hmm. we're in the right chat, right? We're in this. Yeah, we're stream chat. Jeez, I'm leaving. We come back real quick. Yeah, it might be because you were deaf and doing some shit. Maybe. Uh, it, normally you guys show up. There you go. I even hopped in another service. Are you shopping, Dolphin? That's great. Ah, oh, this cup is real. Uh, maybe I need to redo your... Because uh, Discord did just update. Maybe I need to redo uh, your ID. Uh, My, if that's true, I'll have to do that for everyone. Oh, that's going to be fun. Oh, well, I mean, all it is is literally me just going to Discord and going to yeah. the chat. Uh, cop ID. Let's see if this fixes it. Huh. 
yeah, it's just not working for, anymore for some reason. Oh, I wait. I do want to bet the Discord link thing is different now. Oh, man. I love starting streams with technical difficulties. <laughs> So how is everyone tonight while I'm trying to fix this? Nice Halloween costume. Nice Halloween costume. What you gonna what you gonna get? <laughs> is that what Dolphin's saying? To get a Halloween costume? Yeah. I'm gonna wait until I get my Twitch money to buy mine because uh, I didn't get paid a whole lot from work. Well, after bills I won't have a lot to play around with. I don't know if I'm can I? Oh no, I. I will be out of lockdown by the time it's actually like Halloween day. So maybe I should. My plan has been to. <coughs> um. Dress up as. So my favorite artist, music artist, um, has like this alter ego account they have where. Yeah. They, they focus specifically more on like undead and spooky shit. It's like they're, they, I, I think I, they probably drop an album around Halloween, but I haven't paid attention Is to it. Nanners? Usually. No. It's Josh A. And they have, yeah, this like character will revive, which is basically just them after dying as like a Grim Reaper. But uh, they've got a pretty cool design. So oh, did I'm basically Discord's going to. Break? the thing it did <laughs> oh oh dude it's an l for vtubers worldwide i think the new discord update broke the talking png we'll have to fix it later Chill. that you know, well here's what we, well, i've got a place for them got an idea is it just ordinary pngs that i'm just gonna talk? throw the png <laughs> Let me just download the PNG real quick. <laughs> oh no, don't go to the homework folder. working properly either yeah the whole internet has been shitting itself Everything's since like breaking 40 hours ago anyway, uh, let me go to the blurb website real quick for me. you know it does make sense that it would break it because didn't discord just completely change how avatars work because they made it so that you could have it different on different servers i didn't know that yeah, they because they, they did that just recently, and um, Here's a PNG which is good PNG. because you know it gives me shivers when I think about people saying that like they have to fuck they have um stretch hydrate hydrate. Oh. Okay. Try turning my internet off and back on. It's not my internet. Um, all right, I will get to these in just a moment. I'm trying. I'm doing technical difficulties at the moment. It's uh, I drink the water, bro. Okay, go to blur. <laughs> Real quick. But yeah, does your on-screen chat show those type of emotes? No, it doesn't. What type of emotes? The. On my old stream, if you typed in monkey ass, it would yeah, it shows up. The actual monkey ass emote. It'll show up on, on the. That. Oh, maybe they they must have capitalized strong now. Yeah, it'll show up. Some emotes show up, some don't. Uh, yeah, I, 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 you have to like to choose this. five, don't you? Uh, I didn't or choose some any. shit. Log in with Google. I think that was the one. Oh no, that was with that one plugin. I don't know. <laughs> oh, I do. I do love that so much. Actually, I need to change my Microsoft account to have that because I'm 
make my uh, logging in experience more comfy. Okay, so that was the wrong login. Right, yeah, the internet. Uh, cut me, please deal with the frame droppage while I'm trying to fix things, sorry. <laughs> that's the right password. Or that's the right email. Did you know, my phone... My Apple ID was at some point, I didn't have one, I just used my mom's like a long time ago. So on one of the devices when I made my personal one, okay. it, um, they kind of like got fused together. I have a bunch of contacts to like people I don't know because of it and shit. Um, and I think my sister also used my mom's Apple ID. And there's, you know that thing where you could set, you could set it up so that you um your phone when you type in one thing it will suggest another and i i used to use it for like i would have it so that when i type in um like at g it would just type in at gmail.com without me typing as much yeah save time um, okay, but I think my sister there. put like giant ASCII like artworks for some random phrases, and I don't know That's where crazy. that fucking setting is gone. But sometimes I type in like B O, and it just fucking puts up like this random this. like smiley face, and I have to delete like a paragraph worth of characters. Uh, oh wait a second. <laughs> Let's see. Did I accidentally hide something? Oh, that's right. I need to buy Luigi's hamburger. Yeah, well, you haven't? No, Lurk, but I have played money now, so... Uh, the fun! We're starting off the news dash section with uh, me technical... Okay, so Blurp seems to be broken right now. I'm sorry. Uh, I don't know what to do. We'll have to try some stuff later <laughs> I'm sorry about that guys this is a true Nintendo e -shop yes moment. Luigi's hamburger is some great A beef that's what the Vita <laughs> has said all right I'm gonna yes. go ahead I may have to turn actually to look at my TV <laughs> if I start struggling in this please re-enter my password you want a refund I cannot refund channel points I'm sorry Well, we got great other ones. We got Ara Ara. Uh, we got... You can hydrate the Tamaguchi. Put the money in the bag. Uh, you can put on the glasses if you got enough. Listen, babe. If you run out of channel points, just ask me. I've got <laughs> a bunch. I'll just do it for you. I'm sorry. I didn't know what... I don't know what broke it. The internet is just broken right now. With a lot of... Yeah, people. it broke you. Okay, Dude, so I did make the tutorial right before clip. stream. Make... Too mad saying, nah, it broke you, hey. Is that, a, is that a thing? Yeah, I... you, there's a video where he send takes me the audio. computer line of tech tips. Yeah, send me the audio clip it. specifically, and I will make it a thing on Blur. Right? Yeah. Alright. Oh, wow. It's so funny that we just like, make a fucking computer that is worse than the one he already has. And he's like, what's wrong with your current computer? It's like, I broke you. And it's like... <laughs> it's Lot unlocked level 2. So, the reason I decided re to buy the game, though, recently... There's some... Uh, is that some? No. Uh, is because recently, they dropped a new DLC for the game. And it is Toho Music. Uh... I'm trying to see what level I need to be to unlock it. <laughs> I love it. 
Let's see. <laughs> Happy Otaku Volume Pack 12. Can I imagine you don't have song request on. <laughs> no, no, not right now. <laughs> that would be stupid, yeah. Alright. Chat. Watch this video. <laughs> Up treatment, happy otaku pack, cute as everything, muse radio, collabs. Kuthunga. Let's see. <clears throat> Let's see what we can find. Let's see what this. Let's do bad things together. This is the name of this album. Nice. Wait a second. It's not terribly long. Let's see what we got. <laughs> oh, this was the bop. Toho like a doujin? No, Toho is not a doujin. <laughs> there are two popular Toho in the world exactly. that most people will think of if you say Toho. One is the Bullet Hell game series with fantastic music, and the other is the film company that makes Godzilla. They're also called Toho. What? <laughs> yeah, you didn't know the name. I am not a true Godzilla enthusiast in this show. Actually, I bought the fucking, like, the one that came before Godzilla vs. Kong, like, King Kong. Um, right here next to me. I, I have an optical drive in my computer, just so I could watch DVDs before I realized I was never going to watch DVDs again. Um, I've been meaning to watch this for four years, but yeah, I haven't bothered because I'm not a huge movie guy. You got a bunch of music, though. Uh, River was telling me that, though, about this, and it's out. So I don't know how to access the Toho music. Oh, wow, there's just so much music. Ooh, what's this? Moe shops in this game. Ooh. Nice. And Snail's House? Pixel Galaxy! This game is great. <laughs> I haven't even gang, played gang. much of it yet. It's got Snail's Galaxy and Moe Shop. Wait a second. This is great. What is the... Jesus, do me a favor. Look up mm. and see what the game album for the new uh, thing is called. For the new Toho set. Okay. New Toho. Use dash to Toho. Oh, do, apparently. Where's camera dancing? Is that in this game? Or... I'm starting to see who... uh, I'm, what I'm looking to see what the album's called. Yeah, like see where it had to unlock it or something. Mm -hmm. 
see your takus. One way I'm looking at stuff, see what I recognize right now. I know brain powers in this game. Yo, Cotton Candy Wonderland. Yo. Yeah. yeah, I have uh, no idea, bruh. Uh, Ping River, tell River to get in here. Seriously though, is Cameron dancing in this? Does anyone know? Neezy would know. Has so much good. Is not here. alive right now. Are they not? No. They, why are they not alive right now? They're asleep in their coffin. Wait, they're awake. Not a vampire. <laughs> also, they're normally awake around this time. How can you possibly not find it? Because there's so much fucking music in this shit. I've been scrolling for seven years. Is it the Wii Shop? <laughs> yeah. There's so much music because... Okay, so there's a lot of shit that's locked at 60. Oh! They have come. River's... River! We're trying what? to find the Toho music in Muse Dash. Like I said, I already told you I don't know where it is. Me either! Also, I bought Muse Dash. Yeah. I still haven't found Toho. I haven't found it either. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna buy. Also, I haven't found. <laughs> I also haven't found brain power. Also, uh, talking TNT broke. So you're just a disembodied voice right now. Did they leave? No, I'm distracted listening to Owl and Feverish yell about Bo Jiden. Bo. Okay. <laughs> I think there's a mod. I love that so much. <laughs> This is this is chaotic. I'm gonna leave. Bye. Okay. Okay. Something well, that was terribly exciting. wrong with my paper. All right. All right. Let's actually play this game. <laughs> yeah, that'll help. Ready? Go. Um. Oh, the fuck. Beat the shit out of this guy. <laughs> Ow. Okay, it's the other button. Oh wow, look at that. There's nothing wrong. I It might be because the whole internet broke you. Purchase. Yeah, I will spend the next 20 fucking minutes doing my whole credit card.
I think this is the quietest I've ever been on stream. I tried and got the focus. I got the focus. Aye, aye. Moto mushi. I don't know what she said. Cat Jam. Hey, it's Marky Boy. How you doing? It's very much a Japanese game. Yes, it is. But it's also quite enjoyable. But I'm just... Uh, I do love rhythm games quite a bit. Uh, I've actually got uh, the Project Diva game on here. Level up. Favorite plane. Anyone else have an audio delay? Or well, try refreshing your page and see if that fixes it. Um, that would be a good way to fix it. Yeah, let me see. Hard to tell right <laughs> Watch it, what you doing is the name of the song. Three para para. Let's try this one. Because I, I like this it one. This seems one's to be about. insane. Okay. Yeah. Ready? Go! Oh, come on. <laughs> I have successfully given Nintendo my money. That was very hard. <laughs> Oh wow. Okay. <laughs> the song slaps, but holy shit is it kicking the shit out of me. Three, two, one. Okay. <laughs> Let's try this again. Restart it. <laughs> Song's really good, I do like it. Still delay, but I don't really care. How bad of a delay is it? I need to get a bit more practice in on how the game works. I try. I also. It slaps super hard and I like it. Like, I see you slapping. Don't hear the slap till it slap the next one. Really? I don't know, because every time I check, I manage to, like, I manage to be halfway through. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm actually gonna look like at the, the menu television. where I can't tell. I'm gonna look at the television instead of at the delay, because that might help me a little bit. Uh, that means a little less head Radio. movement than normal, but it, it'll be fine. Ready? Go. Let's Kay. get this cake. <laughs> Up. 
I doing worse? Apple presses the keys so fast that the I'm... delay helps her. <laughs> Honestly, I think it's, I've not played this song yet, and it's a slower song. I've always had problems with slower songs in rhythm games. Alright, that wasn't bad. We got a C. We got a C. Consecutively clear two different stages and totally burst into fever mode plus three times. Or three plus times. Ooh, I like that art. Yo, I got a dried fish. I got a dried fish in a paper plate. Heart pounding flight. Okay, so I need eight baseballs to unlock her. Oh, I can unlock Christmas version. Or I already have. Part time worker. Great skill in music dash history. Power to defy laws of physics. Rotate the device 90 degrees counterclockwise and turn it. In and turn it into a vertical rhythm game! <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, I've almost got enough done. Uh, I need like five more. Part time warrior is my favorite. Yeah, this looks like a drawing I made. Let's see what. A zombie. Wow. Hold not hold the, the button slash screen and the save up will automatically attack marked enemies. Keep in mind this will reduce your score by twenty percent. Okay. There's so many like different character unlocks, I like this. Oh, this is the girl from Groove Coaster. The, the little goblinoid characters. Yeah. The streamer from Cytus 2, Neko, ha Pound, Uwu. Uh, or Owo, I think is what that is. She will become invincible after her HP drops to zero. The score will not be recorded if you clear the stage in the state. Yeah, a collab character that can't, that won't die. All right. I want to, I want to try part-time warrior. <laughs> oh look. Let's try Magic Wonderland again. What with this?
High School Crash Project, yeah. I like this. I like the skin for this. This is funny. Is use das. Hello, use das. How are you doing, use das? <laughs> what? <laughs> Gerbil just comes in and just says use das. <laughs> How you doing tonight, Very Gerbil? Very true. I'm a. I'm made of paper and crayons. All right. <laughs> I, I really want to get her. I want baseballs. Look at the <laughs> logo, use da. <laughs> Look at the logo, use das. Oh. What does the use dash logo look like? I have no idea. You can't <laughs> see it properly because my, uh, it's like overlay. <laughs> True use dash moment. I got one of those. I've got one dried fish for the kitty cat. Hey, so what, yeah. what are these? This person will not stop until. Oh, by holding these, I unlock a bunch of stuff. Up, oh, stretch. It's time to stretch. All right, we stretch oh. left. Oh. We stretch right. We stretch up. We stretch down. We stretch forwards, and we stretch back. Oh, okay, we're set. We're set down. Also, I may have made a very large glass of. Uh, <laughs> Maybe made a very large glass of uh, strawberry daiquiri that is already melted. <laughs> what are these American words you speak? <laughs> alcohol. It was an 18 plus stream. Oh, I can drink yeah. alcohol. Fuck yeah! <laughs> <laughs> that sounds awesome. Yo, look at that. Look at these hands. Look at these. Ow, I think a band aid's not enough. Alright, let's try another song. Oh, we unlocked this one. Keep it. Uh, minus. Five minus misjudgments. 
You're good. Also, they say you gotta keep that posture good for when you cuddle real hard. Oh, they're shooting spike fucking saw blades at me. <laughs> Missed my chance to hit the boss. Well, that could have gone better, and I'm pretty sure I didn't get the achievement. <laughs> what did you expect them to shoot? Soft things that wouldn't hurt you? No, I expected them to shoot, like, turnips, not saw blades. I got a B on that. I fucked it up really bad, but I got a B. I got a B. I have two more paper airplanes. Pancake is love. Yes. Oh yes, next time I'm getting mugged, I'll whip out a turnip. <laughs> you casually carry saw blades on you. Is that what you're inferring? <laughs> Just in case of muggers. Listen, I don't have a bag of holding in real life, so I can't do that. Let's see, what, oh, that one had a one. Let's wrap up. Ooh. Oh, Pixel Galaxy. Let's go. We're gonna go play some Pixel Galaxy. Muse Dash. Why is bro literally every word <laughs> that could ever be negative to say about someone is like gets held for review. It yeah. was like, how dare Crunchy say the word fool? I already that's the thing is I already un did fool, so What are you supposed to say? Perfectly fine person that in my personal opinion could be a little bit smarter if preferable. Like <laughs> 
how tame how tame is the word fool? <laughs> no, it highlights the word, it's got a problem. I already like <laughs> already allowed the word fool once. So it should have been added to the whitelist. Which has always been a little bit of a little bit of a law. On the rules front front. <laughs> you fall. <follow me. laughs> yeah, we did it. We got through We got a B Melee fight totally Totally knocked back 20 bosses melee attacks. Totally collected 50 notes. Nice. We got through uh, Pixel Galaxy. Level 5. Stream. Barry, go. Let me know when you got Luigi's Mansion phone, by the way. I love lettuce fried rice. Future pop. <laughs> Do they have a pop candy? I don't know. I have not seen it yet. Holy shit, Grass Snake. <laughs> That's the name of this dog, is Holy Shit, Grass Snake. See the whole just like name it whatever absurd bullshit Black you Reaper. can think of thing from Dojins is not <laughs> exclusive to Dojins. <laughs> Dojins. <laughs> I thought you were explaining about the song named Grass Snake. No, it's just called Holy Shit Grass Snake. My life is for you. Alright, these are all locked. What was that new one I locked? Stream. A 
Let's see what the Lydia boards are. Although you sleep about a song named Brass. <laughs> Yeah, I like this song. Also, this theme is spooky. So Halloween theme. Reach 100 combo in a stage. Wow, I didn't even realize. Congratulations on entering the ranking. Yo, Carl Rocco is is hosting with one good people. Doesn't matter how many good people you got, as long as they are the best. Thank you for the host, Rocco. Let's go. This this is in fact a very spooky game. You know, I was actually browsing the uh, the eShop, and I was like, I'm gonna go into genre and I'm gonna see what horror games they have. Uh, apparently, on the Nintendo Switch eShop, there is not even a genre for horror games. So <laughs> fair enough, I guess. All the horror games are classified as other things. Use dash ninety eight. Hey there. Hey, yeah. I'm doing alright. Uh, we're, we're having a good time. Playing Muse Dash, new game. Here we go, we're gonna go. We're gonna pancakes are yes. I forgot this next song name. There we go. go. Hmm.
There we go. How's he miss partying on Monster Hunter? We still oh pancake is love. Funny, it's funny. We still play Monster Hunter. Uh, it's just we're playing some more, playing some different games, playing some spooky games for Halloween. Spooky we got, like, games. We got Luigi's Mansion uh, up on the docket later, as well as Monster Prom. The game is part Endless Runner, part Taiko no Tatsujin. Yeah. Mustache is spooky game. Yeah, it is a little bit. It has spooky stages. I think it counts. Yeah, I actually want to get uh, Taiko no Tatsujin, uh, but the problem is I want to also get the peripheral where I have the drum. And I'm waiting for it to go down in price a little bit before I actually buy it. I want to play this one. Because this one sounds like a bop. Yeah, look at this. Spooky Japan. That actually happens to me pretty often. No, I don't think I yell. Very quiet again. I don't like when I'm very quiet. <laughs> 70 bucks. For, 70 bucks is a lot for the drum, but it's actually really high clock to step down the throat. Still. Yeah. This game's Muse Dash. Uh, it's really good. I like it a lot. It's been a game I've been on the fence about for a while, but they recently dropped a new DLC for it, which in the Switch version is included with the base price. Uh, and it's got a bunch of Toho music that I need to unlock somehow. I haven't figured that part out, but there's apparently a new Toho. Rather, it is. It says it's out. Yo, Toy Bone and Paper Plane. Oh, yeah, while I'm thinking about it, on top of. Like all the music you unlock, you also have variations and different playable characters that have different that change the game up in different ways. I'm one paper plane away from getting Burrow. You about to order it from Play Asia? Yeah. And one paper airplane away from uh, getting Burrow. Uh, 
uh, pilot hero becomes invincible while bursting into fever mode. The greatest skill in Muse Dash history to power to uh, defy the laws of physics. I'm gonna try this character again. I want to do this song again because I like it. I'm, I'm gonna turn my controller sideways. Yeah, this has done some crossover with other rhythm games like uh, Groove Coaster as well. So, Yeah, I actually like this holding the controller like this. I really do. I don't know if there's any benefit like to the gameplay wise, because it says, "Hey, turn your controller 90 degrees." now than I did last time though. Oh, I actually died. Alright, turn Anka. Yeah. My emo my channel emotes are Anka. Santaoka failed. Yeah. I died. It turned into a vertical rhythm game. Oh, it wants me to turn... It wants me to turn my TV 90 degrees. Okay, I understand what it wants me to do now. Well, Christmas gift run. Clearing a stand shows a 5% <laughs> <laughs> accuracy can be added. Yeah, there's just like so many characters and variations. Hold on. Hold on. I don't understand that gimmick right away. Yeah, but they each have different. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna do this one again because I really like this song. I'm 423rd in the world, is what that said.
I missed him. Past that time. Sentoka. Good job. New best. I got a new best. Nice. Holy shit. So how long are Luigi Mansion, DJ? Good question. Velvet says, "Hey, Zoom." Yeah. They're asking how much pudding you can fit in your face. <laughs> I can see that they definitely typed that. Yeah. Is there a I demo? Think you uh, be cute I don't know if there's a demo. Yeah, funny Luigi Mansion to be downloaded. My Switch just fell asleep, so it didn't actually tell me. Okay, I'm gonna do a couple more levels and then we'll move on to Luigi Main. I... Now, can I go straight into it or is it a bad game and therefore I have to do a bunch of tutorial crap? We first? should be. Uh, I, uh, why don't you go ahead and load it up and while, we're, while you're waiting and tell me? Because I don't remember. Yeah. <laughs> Horrible plush demon. Thank you! I got called a horrible plush demon. There are things I want in there. Oh. Like tapioca pudding. So am I going to scream pop? Yeah. Scream park slash screamscape? No, you want to like screenscaper is where the online multiplayer would be. Okay, well it's not asking me how many players, so let's do it. Yeah, Rocco, how you doing? I haven't seen you in a while. Um, I've been busy last... I was busy last week, so I didn't even see what you streamed. Oh, I got... Achieve less than five misjudgments. Uh, solo. Total play, 50 sheets, hold note completely. Congratulations on entering the ranking. Uh, my position for that song is 2,319. I'm, I'm so good... <laughs> you are poggers. 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 Yo, we unlocked Boro. Also, 
Wow, pretty girls. Totally unlock seven characters. Dolphin, I, it's blurb is still not working. I'm sorry. You're back from the dead. Oh, we got got Boro. Okay, just been busy with school paperwork. I've been streaming a little bit earlier in the past couple of streams. Yeah, I get that. I've had to take a few days off here lately because my work's been killing me too much for me to be able to stream at night. Got the rush armor for me. I've been streaming retro. Rush armor skyward sword easy. Yeah, I got the rush armor too. Uh, they dropped a new DLC quest or a new event quest. I think this l a few days ago, where you can fight Apex Rathalian and Rathalos. Did a stream of that. We, we were bake. We called it breaking up the double date. I want to do this one again. <laughs> I really like this song. It's it's bumping. Yeah, it's really, it act, it's really fun. Did you? Oh, is that is my Discord still reference that one? I changed my, I got a new one. Uh, I may have put porn as my profile picture twice, and that was literally all it took because there's always good rules on the good websites that we use on the good internet. <laughs> that makes sense. Um, yeah. Hang on. Get it. Zoom, zoom, that's naughty. <laughs> that's naughty. Well, you know how it is. Also, why why am I not in the airplane? Why am I riding a bear? Yes. Ow. Dolphin. What what have you done to hurt yourself? Level eight. How do I favorite a song? I 
and new parts here. Yeah. Do one more song and then we'll s we're gonna swap. You bit your inner, your mouth twitch, you bit the, your inner lip. Ah. Sorry to hear that. Yo, Jeezy got me so shiny. Jamie Shores. Jamie Shores. Jamie Shores. Jamie. Jamburger. <laughs> Sounds awful. <laughs> yeah, I try not to visit my Twitter page on my computer because they might notice that it's the IP of a similar Twitter account that's been banned permanently. That's the fucked thing. If it was just like a fucking month ban, I would have been like, oh, okay. No Twitter for a month, and I would have never done it again. But instead I had to like go undercover. <laughs> Oh, I didn't spam it. What's wrong with it, do you know, is what they what, what they have asked. Oh, I... I assume the power supply is just... Broken. <laughs> broken. Which I'm aware is pretty dangerous, but... Brokey, frokey. I like to live off on the edge. Alright, uh, we're gonna take an intermission real quick, and then we're gonna swap over to Luigi's Mansion. Luigi's Mansion. It could it could also be RAM or CPU or motherboard. Okay, we'll be right back.
more RAM. Yeah. Well, the the thing is, I I need to fucking upgrade everything. So the question is, do I replace motherboard, CPU, and RAM first, or do I replace the power supply? Because if I upgrade, if I replace the power supply, and it turns out not to be the power supply, I will have wasted quite a lot of money. But if I upgrade the motherboard and CPU, which is the big ass bottleneck of my computer, big ass even if it's bottleneck. not the problem, big ass it's going to be a good solution. Hey, like it's going to be a Luigi good situation Mansion. anyway that I spent the money. Also, um. Probably just overheating or something. Nah, I brokey. Nah, I brokey. Nah, Luigi's spaghetti meatballs. Hell yeah. Luigi's spaghetti and meatball. Yeah. yeah. Luigi's spaghetti and meatballs. Computer brokey. This came out in 2019. On Halloween. Fuck yeah. Alright, we're gonna go... Scream Park. It brokey. It brokey. Alright, we're gonna... Let's play... Some fun games. Floaty Frenzy. Brokey Frenzy. Brokey. <laughs> okay. Ghost Hunt. Anyway, Scream... Oh, we got Scare Scraper as well. I do not have Scarescraper. You might need to start the game, yeah? Like, do start your save fall and whatnot. Do two play. Oh, uh, yep, this is local. So, Scare... Yes. Yeah, sc uh, Scream Park is local. Scarescraper is your online. So, you need to have it... Just start a save file real quick. I don't even think you need to get very far in it. Like, as soon as you're able to save, just save and quit. <laughs> it's gonna be okay, bro. Is it? Is it going to be okay? Because you're gonna Everything play Everything is gonna be fine. Gonna Everything go is gonna be not brokey. It's, it's very brokey already. Everything is brokey. Everything is brokey. Upsetty spaghetti. There's a yeti in my spaghetti. Alright, we're gonna go online play. Alright, if anyone chat wants to play too, uh, we can. We'll do... We'll do five floors to start off with. Luigi number one. Alright, now we are just... Hi. Waiting on Jizu to do his thing. So, how is everyone in chat doing? You guys enjoying stream tonight? You trying to enjoy Muse Dash? You can't co op, online co op the campaign, unfortunately. I don't think you can, anyway. We could totally do that. That'd be fun. 
If you can't, let me know if you can online co-op the campaign. Then we could totally do that. That'd be something really fun. Also, my drink's warm. Getting warm, anyway. I need to drink it faster. I'm about halfway through it. Did Jizum crash again? Jizum, did you crash again? Ah, I broke. Did that? Did it? Jizum Gaming? Jizum, hit YouTuber Jizum Gaming? What are you doing? Jizum Gaming? Hello? Hello, friend. It broke -y. Oh, he's deaf. Looking at cat plushies because you don't know what to buy. Uh, buy a tabby. Buy a tabby cat. So you might have to play by himself till he gets Gooigi, but I'm fairly certain you can. Yeah. He's also death muted. All right, we'll go ahead and we'll do some stuff by ourselves. Baby, come back. You can blame it all on me. <laughs> Cause I need your love And I just can't live without you Yeah That was Gooigi here Ba doop Suck the rat. Suck up the rat. Rats, rats, we are the rats. Alright, we need to go find the ghosties. Play co op locally. Yeah, I thought that. I thought that might have been the case. Did this guy get out from behind the cap? Get out from behind the so. Sir. Sir, get out from behind the chair. I can't do anything, because I think I'm also trapped in this room until like, oh no, I'm not. He's still stuck. Yeah, he's still stuck. He's just stuck back there. There we go. We'll just go to a different room for now. Oh, the purple snatchers. The goobies. The Goobies wanna... They wanna be Goobies. Motherfucker! 
Come back here. I'm gonna teach you a lesson. I'm gonna teach you a lesson as well. I've cleaned an entire room. I'll teach you how to be happy. I'll teach your grandmother to suck eggs. Uh, there's a door. Uh, it says sucking you. <laughs> it's what got censored. <laughs> Gonna head to bed. Want to get up early. Have a great. Thank you for stopping by, Rocco. I'm glad you could enjoy what you could. You have a good night. The lighting looks so fucking good. <laughs> yeah, it does. Yo, the Switch may be a little underpowered, but all of the games Nintendo pumps out for it are, look gorgeous. Ow. Sir. Sir, stop. Sir, why are you so angry? Why are you so angry? Where is he? Where'd he go? Got up. Alright, got more time. Ninja Carl. Where does this take me? To a gr room with the purple guys. Purple stranglers. <laughs> Sucker. Oh, he's in the wall. I, I, these are my least favorite ghosts. Got ten of twenty four. <laughs> Time's up. You walk you're a walking TOS violation. All right, let's quit. GZ? GZ? GZoom Gaming, are you here? GZoom Gaming? Oh, he's deaf muted again. What the hell? I'm trying to, but he, he keeps deaf muting. Uh, while we're waiting, well, let's go see about the scare scraper. If I can do any of that stuff solo. 
I don't think it can. Jesus just freaking died. Babe, don't be a flake. It's a, it's unbecoming. <laughs> He's playing the game. One player. Yeah, let's do that. <laughs> Straw bulb. Shook. Walk. Suction shot. Alright. Alright, so we load the we load the cannonball. Uh oh wait, no, we put it in on the other end. Put it in on this end. There we go. I got one. Uh, steal the cannonball. Incorporate the ghost hunting into the mini game somehow. Uh -oh. Yo, double point. Double point. Yeah. Nice. We're doing mini games while we're waiting for Jesus. Ah, uh, missed. I got cam, bow. Ah, uh, didn't hit anything. Team Luigi wins. Let's go, let's go try another game while we waiting for Jizum. Because Jizum don't want to be, is doing weird things. Let's see. Race around. We're going to race around rubber ducky rings. Blow shock direction. I got bloated. I got popped in. Uh. 
I still don't have the fucking skyscraper, bro. How'd you manage that? Did you get the Did you get the poltergust? No. Why are you deaf muting and not talking to us? I'm trying to. I am looking at the fucking <coughs> gay little beginning short uh, cutscenes. I popped it. I popped. Yo, Jay Z. Yeah. Uh, that your significant other said, "Don't be a flake." I won't. Beans. This man. Beans. Heinz beans. What? This man out here eating beans. What the fuck? Motherfuckers threw out two perfectly good donuts. I was kidding, babe. Don't let him take it out of context. Uh, don't let her take it out of context. Thank you very much. Oh. I think I've seen footage of this car. <laughs> what footage have you seen of this car? I don't remember. It was fucking forever ago. Is it fucking footage? Yeah. Oh shit, you got the thing. You got the puppy. The tutorial in the game's rather short, honestly. Like, su here's how you suck, here's how you blow, here's how you jump. Ah, uh, don't feel bad. I'm sure Crunchy can teach me how to blow and suck. See, exactly. This is what I'm saying. Don't feel bad. <laughs> Just stunning my fucking dog. <laughs> yeah, your dog's kind of a ghost. Did you know that? A little bit. Yo, Monster Pump's gonna be interesting tonight if it's just me and you, because Danielle's kind of passed out, I believe. Why is Luigi's mustache so black in this lighting, but his hair is like not totally normal? I didn't see the bomb there. Oh, secrets. I don't... Ah. Uh. <laughs> oh, and Scarescraper also requires Jeez. Does it really? Yes. Uh... No, it well, Jeez is not playing this tonight, then. Unless... Because <laughs> it's like a good oh, bit... It's a good bit before you get Gooigi. Well, I wish honestly, games should not have you do more than fucking five minutes of the game before unlocking multiplayer. It is stupid. At least, at least unlocking the oh, the fucking whirlpools went the other way. At least just have. Uh, you do the tutorial. Yeah. Like, I should definitely just be able to get a multiplayer from this point, but... Yeah. No. Well, I guess tutorial is technically it, not done. At least it's not Monster Hunter stories. Oh, bro, hang on. Just, uh... Do, like... What for a first-time player would take, uh, like... A third of the game, I think. Fucking, yeah. Just play the whole fucking game, bro. Just, like, yeah... 
You know, the multiplayer, that's just the in game, motherfucker. You have to, like, fucking finish the whole game on New Game Plus 20 times, and then you can, like, do right. one multiplayer level. Alright, so the last of my money I have now after buying Muse Dash has, uh, has to stay in my thing for the Gura. Um, for my Gagwa Gura. Ow! Android. These fucking rats bit me? Kidding me? Alright, so are we just gonna go ahead and move on to Monster Prom then? Uh, I don't know. How long actually is Gooigi? It's, like it's like an hour or so in. You have to imagine, bro. What the fuck? It's literally um, like you do like the first floor, and then he's like, "Oh, hey, I got something for you. I made Gooigi. He's a gooey buddy, and he's just like you with no emotions." Because. <laughs> I uh I have I'm friends. willing to agree. <laughs> I have friends. <laughs> and I like Monster Hunter stories. And I pl wanna play with my friends. Isn't that right, Jizu? Yes. Yes. Motherfuckers will like X should be the interact button. Yeah. Ah, the switch is broken and Luigi is now breathing in melted plastic. Wait, did your switch just break? No, no, like the, like a light switch, like a, like a, like a, like, like a Minecraft redstone lever apple. Am I speaking your language now? No, please explain in greater depth. Ah, well, basically, uh, these nuts. These nuts what? Got him. All right. Um, well, look at both the. <laughs> both the shut up. Lick my balls. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's play bunch of prom, I guess. Yeah, I'm gonna do the mini game real quick. Because mini I started this min mini game. Mouse plush, you want it? You want a mouse plush? Like a Mickey Mouse? Like a Mickey Mouse? From the Sora universe? <laughs> Yo, fucking, I saw that. I got home. Yeah. And went to watch the thing. And I was like, Jesus Christ, they actually did it. They went with a serious shit post. Sora is equal parts serious character and shitpost. Yeah. It would have been like my fourth or fifth guest. Um. Probably fourth. But like. I don't know. I was just. I was super tired. I was about to go to bed. I and really... then I just. I hear Discord ping. And it's Tsukumi doing like a, like a little watch live stream, reaction live stream. Yeah. And I was like. Alright. Because usually. Um. Usually, I literally don't know where to go to look at, to watch Nintendo Directs, even when I know one that I care about is coming. So I just don't watch it and I wait for the news, but I was actually... Saw it only a was... second or two after it actually happened, so... I, that caught me off guard. I really wasn't ex I'd never... Th I wasn't even thinking that it would be Sora. I forgot Sora was like an actual character that people wanted. Hmm. Well, there's another thing. That's what I was so happy was that it was actually a character that people actually wanted. Apparently, he was the most requested character from when they did the yeah survey. I also Which I, I did to not see, see coming that fact. I, I want to see the results that. of that now. Mario and Pirates yeah. Pirates of the Caribbean now exist in the same universe. <laughs> not really. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Smash doesn't work like that. 
Unfortunately. Also, look at the icon from Use Dash. I love it. What? Where? That's just on my. On my ah! Yeah, I love it. She cut. She cut. Where she... the fuck do I go? <laughs> All right, we're going to Monster Problem. Nothing makes me happier than when a video game be like, hold up, about to not make any sense on how to progress forward. Like, give me a fight that is incredibly hard, sure, but, like, don't just, like, make it hard to even fucking predict what to do next. If I feel like the stream is short, too short after like a run or two of this, uh, which I doubt it will be, I might play some more. Uh, use dash. Cause I lo I really like that game. I thought I'd really like that game because I really like. I've unlocked nine two new images apparently. Oh, it's just the stuff we unlocked last night. I guess I didn't realize I looked at it. Oh yeah, it was like after you're gonna die from happiness. Well, if you die from happiness, you won't enjoy your new plush. You just life. <laughs> Use that fearless win. Uh, when I unlock everything, I was talking to my coworker at work today about uh, Monster Prom. Mm hmm. And now I really like uh. How I really like it. Hmm. You're my guilty pleasure. I sent that to my boyfriend, and he, he sent he responded with hearts, and then sent me Anka, but as Gura's cat. As <laughs> <Gura> cat. <laughs> oh, the fact that that happened right after is hilarious. <laughs> and then I, when I got home. From work, uh, I sent it to Jizum, and Jizum told me that me and my boyfriend were perfect for each other. Yes. Because we're both sociopaths. Yes. No, definitely not. You're psychopaths. What's the difference? I know you don't know the difference. No one knows the difference. Sociopaths don't really feel emotion. <laughs> oh, well, then you're right. I feel emotion Whereas all the time. Whereas psychopaths are like unapologetically insane and relatively okay with the idea of killing people and eating them yeah can i eat you you can certainly want to <laughs> can i consume nine flesh by being a psychopath <laughs> what was that last bit <laughs> I'm being yelled at. Also, do you want to join Jizum? I would love to join. The room ID is 636. Oh, he's mine. Back off. <laughs> uh, me over here trying to find a, ta a good tabby. <laughs> Was just uh, how Aunt to correctly Luke, Luke, Luke Week we mansion. <laughs> Some Anka sippies in chat. We're playing Monster Prom now. <laughs> Anka sippies. You need. We'll try again tomorrow. That's right. I'm gonna try again tomorrow if I stream tomorrow, which probably will, since I don't have to go into work Thursday until five. Nice. Yeah, it is nice. Oh yeah, so after stream last night, we uh, played... Me and Jason played another game. Or, we did uh, do that. This. Uh, we ran into the Kappa character. There's a Kappa character. His name is Leonard. Mm. We both mutually hate the fuck out of that character. You definitely hate him more, though. I hate him more. But we both dislike him greatly. Is that you, Jizu? Yes. Did you just join? No, it's Anthony from the hit YouTube channel Small. Is it really? 
<laughs> yes, it's me. <laughs> oh shit, I didn't know you were Anthony from the hit YouTube series Smosh. Bro, someone's literally just like sitting there typing in ID lobbies for sure. No, someone chat could have just seen it like, oh shit, I want in on oh, this. True. Full game. <laughs> shit, <laughs> nobody's ever streaming uh, public lobbies in a monster prom. from hit YouTube series Smosh. Yeah. What you don't realize is after uh, Smosh died and burnt. <laughs> Fat Giraffe! Fat Giraffe! Fat Giraffe. Where is the Fat Giraffe apple? Come on. Wait a second, <laughs> let me input my it's name. It's a true Fat Giraffe There you moment. go. True Fat Giraffe moment. Yes, it is. It's in here somewhere. Give me a second. Is this it? There it is. Fat giraffe. <laughs> fat giraffe moment. Yeah. <laughs> Real fat. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. <laughs> fat giraffe. <laughs> I thought you were past the fuck out be reals <laughs> ladies and gentlemen this concludes our fat giraffe moment <laughs> we'll be done in like an hour or so we might do another one if you want oh fuck <sighs> okay what what was your name this time i didn't see it jay jeez him you changed the thing. Also, uh, the PNGs yeah. are broken. Yeah, so I'm just yeah, using yeah. a steel PNG of him. Which is nice, because when I had this profile picture, it's got like this like nice grin, but here she's got like this All right. cute here's... little... Alright, here's know, my favorite part thing. of this game. The quiz questions. The part where you choose who you want to date. Who you want even a fucking You've stayed late at chance with. You've stayed late at office. Not at the office, just at office. Of course. There are five people left, and suddenly they start to get naked for no good reason. What do you do? Propose that propose to play the not so well known version of an all time favorite, Sexy Cluedo. <laughs> mm. Okay. Engage in casual conversation. You can finally overcome your social awkwardness by imagining all of them naked. Perfectly. But aren't they already naked? Maybe be the nice. idea is in the future you'll <laughs> always be, be nice and bring them a snack. Them and by that you mean getting naked too, because you're a snack. Nice. Uh, sexy Cluedo. <laughs> Fucking. <laughs> sexy Cluedo. <laughs> Yo, uh. Oh shit, my mic is up. Higher than it's supposed to be. There we go. I'm Sorry. gonna go with be nice and bring them a snack. And by that, you mean getting naked too because you're a snack. So charming. Did you go with it as well? Yes. You're walking through the <coughs> desert when you see a turtle on its back, baking in the hot sun. But you're not helping. Why? Why aren't you helping? Because fuck turtles. Because that turtle owes me money. No time. Too busy twerking. <laughs> Oh, we got ads. Let's get. Let, we're gonna hold on a second. Let the ads roll. It'll be like a minute. The ad, uh, the hour mark did just like roll over. Jesus, I know you greatly enjoy turtles, so this one's gonna be tricky for you. I didn't realize you were so decided on that, but yes, I, you've I told do me. Love turtles. You told me that you <laughs> fucking love turtles. I do love turtles. Also, <coughs> fuck turtles. I know exactly my answer. It's because Cause you know you gotta you gotta choose less of the evils, right? Yeah, no, no time. No way am I choosing this one. 
no time. I would never too be busy. too busy twerking for turtles, but this turtle in particular owes me money. He's a bitch. All right. So wealthy. <laughs> What would be your dream first date? A sweaty and manly wrestling match? Crimes! Oh boy, yes. A fierce fight that starts in lifelong rivalry open, rivalry open to become something else? A professional meeting where you charm your date with some astonishing business advice? An art exhibition experimental enough to give you a seizure? A wild party in international waters? Uh, I like the art exhibition. I also like just crimes. No, let's just go crimes. Crimes are pretty epic, but... Crimes. School just isn't working out. Time to go into... <laughs> Time to go into stripping. What's your stage name? We got Kawaii Pussy Ulu. Max Pleasure Model 3000. Excuse you. I wouldn't be the stripper, honey. I'm the damn pimp. Uh, fuck fest ex triple explosions. Oscar Wilde and Duchess Henrietta Honey Lips the third. I'm hmm. gonna go with a uh, fuck fest triple explosions. Yes, I would definitely. I am. Boyfriend I most Lord enjoy this answer, yes, you but please tell I me. feel like this is gonna be. Yeah, you know, Wait, Zoom, no, gonna I know have, how gonna to have pick locks so we can do some twice. fun crimes together. Uh, all right. Breaking and entering is the sexiest of crimes. Nice. Right next to murder. It is. Yes. <laughs> but yeah, it's not going to have Polly twice, is it? It, it might. Um, no, nah, it, it didn't. Did I knew it was fucking Damien. I could feel it. Damien was fuck fest exclusion. I know. That's why I went with it. Still haven't gotten a Damien date. Re neither a secret ending nor his uh, prom. Fuck yeah. Let's kill five guys together. Like the restaurant or... Well, we, uh, we, we can only kill... We have to spare at least one five guys employee. <laughs> and that one is River. That's the yes. only one. But uh, they're not part of the five guys. She, that River's the one girl. Yeah. All right. So I got nine smart, seven boldness, three creativity, seven charm, three fun. I'm going to go to the auditorium. That day while rehearsing for the class play, it's as though the muses themselves have descended to give you figurative oral sex. Your performance is intense and inspiring. It will be remembered for generations, which is pretty rad by high school play standards. You gain two creativity. You know what? First date, let's pump the brakes on the murder. <laughs> after, <laughs> after you're walking along when suddenly... Fair enough. After, you're walking along when suddenly a car skids to a halt just in front of you. It's not the most logical location for a speeding car to barrel through, and yet, here you are. Vera and Damien hop out. <sighs> The work isn't bad. It's not. <laughs> it's just not at the level it needs to be if you want to win this all-star drag race. It gets a real badass hunk of metal. What's your plan to win, Damien? Just drive your car really, really, really fast. A fucking course it is, Vera. That's literally how street races work. In that way. <laughs> And that may have won you the crown in the past, but it won't work against Justin Dar <laughs> Justin Darrington. Damien, he's driving the Thunderfuck 5000. I like the name of that car. I love the Thunderfuck And I'm driving Nancy, 5000. a pile of shit I lovingly cobbled together out of ev every car I ever destroyed. Either in a race or just literally destroyed via arson or whatever. Yeah, and Nancy can take me on anyone, anything, anytime. Like it's just, it's just a, such a lovely name for it. The, <laughs> the Thunderfuck 5000 is an electric car. Nancy runs on the juice of literal ain't actual dinosaur corpses. What could be more badass than that? So pathetic. I don't know. Maybe running on pure lightning. Nancy's a piece of shit, Damien. 
deep down you know that she does not have what it takes to win us this thing. Seems like the drag race is pretty important to the two of them. And that they're not <laughs> and that they're not gonna come to an agreement on their own. Looks like it's up to you to be the voice of reason. Attitude is everything, but Nancy will never embrace her inner fierceness with all of Vera's criticism. Come on, Damien, let's give this car a makeover or Vera, you're right, Nancy is amazing, but she can't quite make the grade. We have we need to crossbreed her with a faster car. <laughs> Car sex. Car sex. sex. Hydrate. Hydration. Yes, thank you for the hydrate. <laughs> this game is wild. I'm going to go with attitude is everything. Oh, I'm so creative. Hell yeah! A makeover is exactly what Nancy needs to drag Justin Durrington's piece of shit 5,000 to hell and back. After all, the key to winning Danny Drag Racing's cars, uniqueness, nerve, and tire tread. Yeah! I'm one I'm not 100% sure that there's a direct correlation between a car's attitude and speed. But I do know that I'm fierce as hell, always look amazing, and do tend to get whatever I want, whenever I want. So I may... So I may well be on to something. So you may well be on to something. The three of you get to work get to get the cars Luke. What the fuck? The three <coughs> of you get to working to get the cars Luke beat for the gods. By the time you Luke finish buffing the like exterior, painting flames funny. on the side, vacuuming the seats, and adding false eyelashes, Nancy is looking incredible. <laughs> this, this is the ultimate race car. The Thunderfuck 5000 can suck my dick. <laughs> Have you heard the sounds these things make? That's what good <laughs> mac and cheese sounds like. It's probably just overheating or something. No, I broke it. Nah, brokey. Nah, <laughs> brokey. <laughs> it can actually. That's one of the improvements made from the Thunderfuck 4000, which could, <laughs> which could give mediocre hand jobs. Huh? Who cares, Vera? Stop upstaging me and Nancy. This is our big <laughs> moment. We've got the race in the bag. <laughs> That's what good mac and cheese sounds like. <laughs> I bet your car can't even suck your dick. <laughs> You're right, Damien. Good luck, and don't fuck it up. Damien gets back into the newly refurbished car and shoots you the sultry wink of a man who knows his car is about to destroy a race and look flawless doing it. You gain two fun, one charm, and a whole bundle of charisma, uniqueness, nerve, and talent, which as awesome as they are, still aren't stats in this game. All right, Jake. You went with Jake again? Jake from State Farm? Yes. <laughs> That's what I think when I see this character. I'm like, Jake. Jake from State Farm. Well, his name is Oz. He's a bitch. <laughs> that day during recess, you start a half-hour rave that goes full crazy. You have no idea how it escalates so much, but <laughs> at one point, there are like 300 people. Someone summons demons from a nightmare dimension. The consequences might distort the fabric of reality itself, but who cares? It was a rad party. You gain two fun. Meanwhile, Zoe seems to be trapped in, uh, have trapped Polly in some sort of Eldritch binding circle. This should be good. This sounds fucking hot. <laughs> tell me, tell me, <laughs> tell me, tell me, tell me. Also, no, oh, how she died. Yep. Yeah. Girl, where is your chill? Oh, you fucking skipped it. Uh, yeah, but each time you told me something different. Tried to fuck a toaster, suffocated by good booty, gun salad. I've heard them all. But what's the truth, Polly? Huh? Huh? Seriously? It's none of your business. Bitch. <laughs> yes, bitch. No, but it is my hobby, and hobbies matter, Polly. 
Plus, the fans have a right to know. Fans have a <laughs> fans have a right to leave me the hell alone. Secrets are sexy. If secrets are so sexy, then how come God invented Wikipedia? <laughs> what? You're a god. You know, <laughs> you know that's <coughs> not true. Now let me out of this binding circle. I've got a haunted mask next period. Sure, I'll let you out if you tell me how you really died. Polly gives you a pleading look. Zoe gives you an excited look. As usual, it's up to you to figure out who to help. <coughs> I'm sorry, what part of that scenario did you guys not understand? Polly's right. Secrets are sexy. And I'll <laughs> prove it with my new espionage. AU Spooky Highly Classified. Or, Zoe deserves to know the truth. And if you tell her... Tell it to her, Polly. I will give you a huge bag of cocaine. Okay, so first of all, I know that we've seen the other one, and I'm going up to Polly, so obviously I'm just in this. Not so creative. Oh. Wowza, you wrote an entire espionage AU? Can I see? Of course you did. You have a fanfic for every occasion. You reach into your backpack and pull out. This is not a fanfic. This is a piece of old beef with top secret written on it in the in cake frosting. Mm. Why do you have that in your backpack? Is that a se sexy secret? It may be a secret, but it's not as sexy as a trucker cap full of pe uh, spilt split pea soup. The writer of this game... Wow. <laughs> the writer of this game need a raise. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe you should write a fanfic about what the hell is wrong with Jake. Maybe I should. Hey, Jake, what's wrong with you? Tell me, tell me, tell me! <laughs> I actually quite you, like this. <laughs> you try to run, but Zoe's already trapped you in a binding circle. You miss your next class and lose two smarts and one fun. Also, all the characters are Why don't I just tell her? Because <laughs> you don't have a reason for it. You really don't? I can just name what is most wrong with me. <laughs> also, all these characters are currently in their Halloween costumes because ha i that's a setting. Yeah, I forgot to fucking switch to it again because I'm dumb as hell. It's more important that I have it <laughs> because like people actually see my shit. See my end. You know what I mean? Yeah. So right. I did actually get Polly to like me well, but I did lose one fun, which is yeah. not epic. You got a net game and a plus one fun, though, because you got two from that. <laughs> All right, challenge. Mm. Choose a celebrity. Jizu? Brad Pitt. <laughs> uh, fucking... Who's the guy playing Luigi? Charlie Day. Charlie Day's in that. Charlie Day, okay. Player order is decided based on how likely it is that the selected celebrity is secretly part of a cult. I win. I'm, no, I'm, I win. Are you sure? Yeah, you know who Charlie Day is, the fucking guy from Always Sunny who's batshit insane. Oh, uh, true. Reminds me of the guy who got paid literally millions of dollars to name the Pixar movie about cars, cars. <laughs> what? Why was he paid millions? <laughs> uh, what is, is it a movie about cars? I got boxes full of Pepe. Alrighty. Uh, Bruh. what we do? How that much money? That is pretty good, actually. Oh, I might. I'm gonna have to fuck you over, G Zoom. Do it, bitch. I'm gonna have to. You won. Because Damien's at the table with Polly. I gotta do it to you. I'm do sorry. it, bitch. I'm sorry. You arrive at your chosen table to find Damien dejectedly hefting a ball of mashed potato. Oh, we've seen this <laughs> before. Seriously? Oh, fuck it! Look at Damien's costume! Holy shit, that's cool as fuck! I will win. He's dressed as the oh. Slayer! Oh, right, uh. This company's being bled like a stuck Pig Mac, and I got a paper trail to prove it. <laughs> Seriously, what do we have to do to get a food fight started in this cafeteria? 
Honestly, I do not know. I tried throwing potatoes at the people and yelling, FOOD FIGHT! But I think everyone is too scared of me to fight back. That is I, fair. <laughs> I keep throwing the food because of my stupid ghost hands. Plates, mirrors, antique furniture, sure, but not food. There's gotta be a way to provoke a food war! My dad's are my dad's are always telling me to be more political. Uh, but we're not political. Your strength is hitting things, and my strength is being unbelievably hot all the time. Unbelievably hot! That's it! We'll set the cafeteria on fire! No, wait, no, that's not the solution. That's just awesome. Why do I always go straight to Austin? That's the only scene I know from Always Sunny and Charlie, <laughs> and Charlie Day is just a goddamn madman. Yeah. <laughs> it's hard to watch them struggle through this by themselves, so you step in with an idea of your own. Wars are fought over scarce resources. Steal everybody's food and put it in the pile. That ought to do it. Or, hey, Polly, you know how the Greeks fought a whole war over Helen of Troy's face? We just need you to get kidnapped by Trojans. Alright, let's go with that. Whoa, is that what politics is? Beating people up and putting their stuff in a big pile? I didn't know I was already so good at politics. That's what good mac- <laughs> I'm gonna take this and throw this in the pile. <laughs> That's good mac and cheese. And I can roll around the food pile and feel it so good on my non it'll <laughs> feel so good on my non skin. I'd go to war for Jesus' face. <laughs> Damien spends the rest of the lunch piling up everybody's food in an enormous food mountain. Hunger hungry students are soon swarming the mountain trying to grab what they can while Damien pelts them with fire and knives from above. In a panic, the students turn on each other, fighting with the only weapon they have, the food in their hands. Haha, <laughs> food fight, food fight. I think the fight is like this is how I died. The casualties are beyond counting, but one will be <laughs> but no one will be forgetting the food fight anytime soon. All right, it's Jake from State Farm. You got seven dollars. You got the shop available to you. This is true. Unfortunately, I don't really want anything from the shop. You want the penguin mask, but it's like ten dollars, I think. Yeah, I know. However, right, right. You want to see what they imagine have these? <laughs> you, get a, you get the free gift box and see what you get. I get an item that is worth a lot of fun. You get a pound of guacamole from it, or like a kilo of guacamole from it. The presents down there. I don't think I could though. Could I? I don't know what you can get from the fucking thing. It seems to be literally anything, any item in the game. Okay, fun in their own twisted way. Yep. Big brain. Big brain. Alright, challenge. Everybody choose a song. Say your choice out loud. Jizu? Uh. Go, what the fuck is a song that you guys will actually know? That... I didn't say a song every people know, just name a song. Ah, uh, all my fucking music is depressing. <laughs> um, Edamame by fucking Rich Brian and Baby No Money. All right, Rockefeller Street. Players decide based on how inadequate it would be for that song to be to start playing at your funeral. Hmm. They would be pretty equal. I'm the only one who knows what both songs sound like, but... How adequate would your song be at your funeral? How, like, I mean, how, ba how jarring would it be to hear that song at your funeral? Would it be appropriate to play at your funeral, or would it be, like, I really think, fucking it, well, weird? Is it, oh, it's at my funeral as well. Yeah, so, at okay, your funeral. Not as bad. Um... Yeah, it's just like a kind of like a, it's kind of like. Oh really? Um. 
Is song request on? No, because we uh, listen to the game audio, game music. That is what I'm not asking. Um, is it yeah, a fitting song uh, for your fitting or soup funeral or not? No, it's it's like kind of like um, how would I describe it? It's kind of like boasty. It's just like too rich music artists like i'm on a boat saying how good they are <laughs> mine is literally a, just a shit post meme song so in like hollywood that's like a really good dance song that people like to yeah. play on os, os i feel too. like i feel like your like your one's like so cutesy it would be super weird at a funeral whereas like my one's kind of just like for it's kind of music you'd hear at a funeral where the dude like specifically said like I want my funeral music to be kind of like cool. All right. <laughs> All right, so I win. So I think yours is more inadequate. Um, One, you're lucky two, I only seven, just three, realized that Street. you win by it being more inadequate. <laughs> yeah. I not good. You feel that? March. It isn't always nighttime, is it? Like every time. No. I I'm like tripping when it's blue. I'm like, is it always blue? They just nah, it's not go to school at night like they are monsters. They are monsters. Do you see how horrible they are? Yeah. I'm I just a... bought shutter glasses. Uh, I can't go to the auditorium because the shop's there. That is fucked up. I'm gonna go mine some Bitcoin, apparently. It's a shame that I have to go to the rave as often as possible because I find it to be one You're of the most boring out, not murdering stories. anybody when Damien slinks up to you. <laughs> Shit. Well, you don't want to catch you, you don't want to catch you. He's holding a murder. large sack with the words definitely not a corpse written on it. Noob. Hey, um, you're not going to believe this, but there's definitely actually a corpse in this bag. You never would have guessed. <laughs> Now, here's the thing. I'm not saying I'm exactly responsible for making this corpse. At least not without my lawyer's present. <laughs> but let's say he and I r apparently had very different definitions of rock, paper, scissors. <laughs> anyway, I'm not interested in going back to jail, so I need you to help me hide this body real quick. I know, we should hide it in the, in the fucking building of that office, dummy! Fucking, I'm losing the voice a little bit. Let me, I need water. <laughs> <laughs> fucking, he picks up the corpse. Have you heard the sound these things make? That's a good mac and cheese sounds like! It'd be an extremely attractive thing to do! Luckily, hiding dead bodies is kind of your thing. You share your brilliant solution. Disguise him as a drinking fountain. No one will know okay, the difference. Well, <laughs> in that case. Or just chuck him in, the gr in my garage. <laughs> He'll blend perfectly with my collection of vintage dead bodies. I want to go with this. So bold. <laughs> you throw the corpse in the back of Damien's dread chariot. <laughs> Took me I'm sorry, I fucking had an aneurysm there. You throw the corpse in the back of Damien's de dread chariot and hoof it over to your garage. Holy hell! Are these all yours? Some of these are totally classic. <laughs> Some of these are total classics. Elvis Presley, Amelia Earhart. Fuck, you've got three popes here. <laughs> I spent all this time trying to be a great murderer. One well, of the greatest murderer of all is right next to me the entire time. Damien lovingly lays his mangled corpse next to your pristine collector's items. A look at a look of awe on his face. Jokes on him. You're actually just a really accomplished grave robber. <laughs> <laughs> you gain two smarts and one charm. <laughs> Oh ye. Oh ye. Well. 
time for the rave that goes full crazy. Yo, <laughs> radical robot. I'm sure we won't we won't hit Juan. Find Juan. I mean, radical robots. Do you see those, G Zoom? Do you see all the radical robots? I do see the radical robots. Have some cake. Eat a cake. Eat an entire cake. That day during recess, you start a half hour rave that goes full crazy. Hey, how could you? Hey, I have to go for a bit. Do you to do some work stuff? See ya, hun. I'll be back when I can. Your, your significant you, other kitty. has left you. <laughs> how does this make you feel? Like you're going to uh, press the next button so I can read the next paragraph? Thanks. Fuck you, Apple. <laughs> you're casually chat chatting with Juan, the small, magical Latino cat. You start oh, telling wow. him the hilarious story of what happened last summer at Monster Camp. You know which one, the one involving the beehive, the blow-up doll of the president, the penguin mask, and the mystery of the Goblin King? Slowly, lots of people start joining to hear the story. <laughs> By the time you say where the Goblin King was, a hundred people or so burst into hysterical laughter. I love the Goblin King. You turn on a mobile app that captures all the laughter and turns it into too fun. Hooray. After you've eavesdropped on Miranda, after you have e you're eavesdropping on Miranda and Polly, waiting for the perfect moment to mention your influx of instant fol insta followers when. Greetings, my loves. Never. Oh my god, he's dressed up as the Kappa. Is he? <laughs> yes. He's. Oh god. Him again. He is. They are d both douchebags. They really are. To be fair. <laughs> as really myself, I must say that even I find him to be. What's the term you'd use? Paulina? <laughs> it's funny because she's wearing his outfit. Yeah, she is. Extra AF. <laughs> Friendship between beautiful two beautiful maidens shouldn't be uh, soured over by one as handsome, rich, and humble as I am. But worry not, my sweet summer salads. What the fuck is that phrase? I yes. have found the perfect solution to protect your feeble hearts. You shall both marry me. I've dealt with this, with male entitlement before, but this is an official new level. Or an official next level. Yes, and it's an interdimensional level, as our collective wedding will be as well. Yeah, not interested. You are hardly the first prince to seek my real hand in courtship, and I don't see <laughs> see that you're bringing much to the table. Interdimensional table, and I am the definition of marriage material. Don't you see my shirt? It says sin nudes. <laughs> 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 You'll never find a better suitor. I have a castle. I can defeat anyone at anything. I'll show you. I'll fight. Him. Fine. Uh, is the interdimensional prince pointing directly at you? Why is your life like this? <laughs> <laughs> I can defeat you at any challenge. Name your weapon and prepare to lose. All right, Dolphin's back. You've come back. Just the great time. Miranda and Polly are watching you closely. Maybe you can skew the prince's challenge to really impress one of them. You know what would be wild? Naked fencing with live weasels instead of swords. As a royal, you must fancy yourself pretty clever, so let's see you win at losing. Okay, so top one's Polly, bottom one's Miranda. Hmm, but the top one also might require creativity to not fucking... I think I'm going to be real with you. I'm thinking it's probably boldness. Because True. nudity. Which is still concerning. So fuck it. Let's find out. Oh, it was fun. Oh, it's fun. Very yeah. well. If, it, if that is what you wish, then so it's be it. It's all just so he takes off the fucking Kappa cosplay. <laughs> yeah, it really is. Both of you and the prince quickly undressed, thus giving you respective <laughs> weasels amp... Thus giving your respective weasels weasels ample fleshy targets yes you both grab the nearest live weasel and take the traditional weasel fighting stance of course you ever okay so let me clarify what that is if you've never seen kung pao 
the official weasel uh, fighting stance is you wield a weasel like a fucking nunchuck. Ah. <laughs> On the count of 100, one, two, just go. Normally the interdimensional prince years and years... <laughs> Normally, the interdimensional prince's years and years of royal swordplay training would have defeated you in seconds. But fighting with <laughs> mucilids is a weasel of a, of a different color. <coughs> I did. I had a hard time with that sentence. You've defeated opponents with polecats, ferrets, and minks, and the prince is no exception. <laughs> you leave him staggering and bleeding from many tiny... <laughs> Teeny tiny bite marks across his naked body. That is kind of. He then puts <laughs> his clothes back on in a defeated demeanor, basically because he, <laughs> basically because we have no model of him naked. Mm. Curse you, cat snake! Your long furry body and sharp little teeth are adorable and painful. <laughs> yes. Wild! I love weasel fencing. <laughs> You're pretty cool, Jake. With that, the prince disappears, leaving you and your weasel to hit on your fellow high schoolers in peace. You gain two charm, one fun, and a fucking weasel. <laughs> it's which is Let's cooler go. than a normal weasel. Something happened to Mimi. Let's do this. You're engaging in your favorite weekend activity. All right. Heroin. Ignoring anything in favor of thinking about which classmate you'd like to take to the prom and how horny you are. <laughs> <laughs> when you find out that there's apparent and that this is apparently reading on your face. Hey, Mimi. You seem pretty horny and like someone who sits around all day thinking about who you're gonna take to the prom. Wow. Does she have your number on? <laughs> Does she have your number or what? Listen, I'm kind of interested in someone, but honestly, I don't think I could be with any monster who isn't spectacular at sex. I know sex isn't everything, but it's sort of everything to me. Not really, but it's pretty high on my list of priorities. Right under cocaine and alcohol. <laughs> Sorry if this yeah. is TMI. <laughs> titillating monster interaction. But if, but it's someone you know, so I thought you might have some insight. It's Jake. Yes. I just love sex. Any position. Missionary. Clergy. Apocalyptic. Upside uh, down nightmare demon. The pentagram. What do you think? Could Jake keep up with me? I can only say this. He is the discoverer of the orgasm. Actually, the whole thing is named after him. Haven't you ever noticed the, that the orgasm is an anagram of Jake? Or, are you kidding me? Once I asked him what he thought sex was about, don't ask me why. And he told me that it was na uh, the natural process for most living beings to conceive children. He has no idea. Jake? Orgasm? <laughs> False alarm, just some absolute brain dead guest. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, you're totally right, and I've never even noticed that before. <laughs> I want to know the thought process on that one. Uh, literally. Nothing. Like, actually, it still makes no sense to me, but I'm going to assume that it's because I'm high and it's super legit on this level. <laughs> hey, buddy, yeah. you just blowing stupid. <laughs> hey, buddy, you just blowing from stupid town? <laughs> <laughs> you seem to know your letters and words. <laughs> <laughs> you are fucking wrong! <laughs> I'm sure it'll make sense so once I sober up. Jake invented the orgasm, eh? I'm a fan of going straight to the source. I only buy opium from the <laughs> from 
from the dude who first discovered it being dead rocks. Nice. She buys opium from the guy who discovered it. <laughs> Jesus Christ. It sure does, does it? It sure does. Does it? Man, important thing is Jake, a.k.a. Orgasm, totally owes you one. Not one orgasm, just a general one. You know what I mean. Oh, and you game plus three fun. <laughs> Maybe I should name myself Orgasm next playthrough. <laughs> it, you, yeah, you have to do Jorgasm, because that's have a J. Jorgasm. <laughs> Jorgasm? <laughs> Orgasm? Holy That's shit! Amazing. <laughs> Everybody chooses a movie. Okay, movie, Jizum. Oh, uh, 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 Godzilla. Alright. So we talking about earlier, it was on my, it's on my shelf. I haven't watched it. Alright, uh, um, Pineapple Express. One player is decided based on how hard it would be to explain the selected movie to an old person. Fuck. Both are really hard to explain to an old person. Oh, wait. No, I feel like Godzilla's pretty straightforward. It's like two giant yeah, monsters. Yep, two giant monsters fighting the city. Well, Pineapple Express... An orgasm while wearing jean shorts. A jorgasm. <laughs> so true. <laughs> uh, okay, so Pineapple Express is about is not about a train, Grandpa. No, it's not about a train. It's it's about it's about these guys who get really fucked up and can't remember what they did. No, they didn't have sex with each other, Grandpa. No, they just got... They did a lot of cocaine. You know what cocaine is, right? Anyway, I've proven my point. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Grandpa, do you, you know what cocaine is, right? <laughs> Fuck, I made myself sad just now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, uh, it's my turn. Yo, the bathrooms have the thing. I you know, know what the I'm bathrooms have thing. Okay, they, the penguin mask is there for ten dollars. That is fucked up. I'm gonna buy this. I'm gonna buy this thing. I bet. I'm gonna buy this thing right here. It makes me more creative. Godzilla is literally just big monster. Done. Yeah. Okay, can you do the same Big for the movie of fire. Pineapple Express? What? I was asking your significant other to do the same to describe Pineapple Express. Yes. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> lame llama, lame llama, lame llama, lame llama. Okay, Polly likes. What other was it? Ch Creativity? Sexy sock! I like how the little stickers are random. Sexy sock. Yeah, sexy sock. Yeah, Polly... Polly likes creativity? And fun? Is that? Radical robot. Yeah, okay. Pineapple on a train. That is not the movie. <laughs> Did you not hear me explain to Grandpa? Grandpa, no, there's no trains involved. Oh shit, wait, I just remembered the fucking Pineapple Express is not the hangover, but it does start similarly. Which is people getting fucked up and waking up the next day. <coughs> okay, uh, he explains you're, he was worried that you, uh, people are so used to calling him Juan the Small Magical Latino Cat. That every, now that everyone defines him only by his size, magicality, ethnicity, and species. He he want he's more than that. You correct him. You don't see him in such simplistic terms, inconvenient definitions. It's just that there are around 23 other wands in the school, so adding all that to his name is quite necessary. Ah, wave of tiredness is hit. Uh, chugger. 
Chug a Red Bull. <laughs> Slam an energy drink. Or don't, drink. so that you can sleep. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Do whatever you feel like. I'm not going to make you do anything. You gain two fun. No, it's okay. Suggesting people do terribly uh, inane things is a big part of if my... If I get uh, tired, I just slam a Red Bull so I can stay important. up for another 72 hours. You see Polly looking yeah. unusually depressed. She's usually on hella good drugs at the this time of the day. You ask, what's up? I'm going to live forever. Oh, I do need it, the mask. <laughs> yes, you do. I was yelling at yelling that at a party last night because they were playing that cheesy fame song. You know the one. Uh, how is it? How was how it was called? Is it called "I'm High" and I don't remember? Oh yes, I'm gonna live forever. Yeah. Duh. But then I realized it's like literally actually true. And forever is like a really, really, really long time. You know. What if I run out of stuff to do? What if aliens take over and they ban partying? What if the Earth blows up and I have to live in space with dumb, boring space animals? Hmm. I get bored when the bus takes an extra ten minutes to arrive. How am I ever going to stay hyped for an eternity? I feel that. Uh, you don't have to. <laughs> Whenever you get tired of existing, just <laughs> go meth. piss off a priest. Or meth. Jesus Christ. I know a lot of people like that. <laughs> Both of these answers it? are funny. But I'm pretty sure meth would be a good answer. Go piss off a priest. Yeah, but she probably does meth already. Sometimes. Yes. And that's why I think it's a good answer. Because that's her entire fucking MO. Is drugs and sex. Yeah, I know, but like... Someone comes to you with a problem, and you tell them to do something that they you should know they already do all the time. Yes. To solve it. But... I, I'm going with the top one. Yes! Damn, what a <laughs> dumb way to go out. They'd be like, she died the way she lived, as an abomination in the eyes of the Lord. That is... That is... I want that. Good night, Dolphin. Red. You have a good evening. That is, that is a good... Do you like how I read that? Well, I just... That shit bustin'. That's a, that's a very good, uh... She died the way she what's lived. What's the word? As an abomination in the eyes of the Lord. That's a river. Yeah, exactly. That is river. Man, I've got some really cool ideas for how to piss off a priest. <laughs> Dip all of their little crackers in LSD. <laughs> Priests have little crackers. You know, yeah, for fucking, like, uh, what is it? Uh, not Passover. It's like for... It's basically a thing where you ta partake of the Lord's body and you drink a little bit of wine, too. It's, right, right. It's whatever the fuck that's called. Pour Communion. jizz in the holy water. <laughs> Pour jizz in the holy water. Right, a translation of the Bible that... But way pornier. Yeah, Communion. Oh man, I'm gonna stay entertained for years just thinking of new ways to make a holy dude mad. Thanks! It's a good day to be you, and a bad day to be a priest. You gain two boldness yeah. and one creativity. You're super fun as well. That's the plan. Let's trade places. Alright, let's challenge. Choose a historical figure. Uh, God, it would help if I actually like knew history. Um, he sure is fun, isn't he? <laughs> Jesus <laughs> Christ! Get a room, you two. <laughs> Historic. I feel like I only remember the names of people from ancient China. <laughs> I don't know what that's about. <laughs> <laughs> All right, famous historical. Uh, you need to choose a historical figure. Uh, 
Actually, what was the other? Uh, you know what? Genghis Khan. All right. <laughs> and Frank. Ah. <laughs> Player orders decided based on who it would be. Who it would be the most terrible wingman at a bar? Hmm. Genghis Khan. I win. He raped thousands. So. <laughs> that would mean. Yeah. 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 <laughs> and Frank for sure. <laughs> Is that so? <laughs> nah, Genghis Khan fucked. Yeah. I, I don't think... know. It... <laughs> but yeah, Genghis Khan does I don't like fuck. I don't like where chat's going. I'm gonna hit random because this upsets me. You get first. Okay, which is good because I, I won. I don't want to talk. <laughs> Fuck. You go talk to Polly. It locks me out of Damien. Why the fuck yes. are those two talking to each other so much? Because they're both like. I not don't good, know. Not good pairing. Yeah, they're like loud and relatively sexual on each side nah he wants an anarchist they both like chaos I guess you know Plat chat is literally just me LMA. and me it says Marky boy strange you could have sworn Polly and Damien were at this table when you picked it oh but they're underneath because what was the hey loser down here it's us Polly and Damien hiding under the table for totally innocent reasons a, fury, a furious roar sounds from the door of the cafeteria. Crazy Martin the Werebear janitor is here, and he's looking for someone. I oh wonder. shit, he's here! Why is he after us anyway? I think what we did really falls more under federal jurisdiction. International law more like those munchkins of Canadian citizens. Did I you mention it? I think we might actually have fa to face a war crimes tribunal. Worth it though, right? <laughs> oh, totally. As long as we can get away from it, from Buzzkill the Bear over there. Uh, just hide in the ghost zone. You know, the special alternate dimension only ghosts can use. Or hide from behind diplomatic immunity. I mean, you're both princes of hell, right? <laughs> But I can't hide in the ghost zone. I'm not a ghost. I guess you should have thought of that before you spent all your time being alive, huh? Being alive isn't a choice. <laughs> Whoa. Okay. I don't. <laughs> I don't have time to sit here and argue pro-life or pro-choice with you, my dude. <laughs> See you in the ghost zone. No, you won't. Damn, here I am. You can't follow Polly into the ghost zone but from the way she winks at you before crossing over. It It looks like you're one step closer to the bone zone where all the skeletons live. The bone yeah, zone. The bone zone. <laughs> Hold on a second. I that, like how... <laughs> we got the bone zone. Like, what exactly is stopping you from just fucking inserting yourself into the situation? There's always a fourth chair. Welcome to the Bone Zone! Yo! Got the skull. Woo! <laughs> okay, what am I? Let's see. Who am I gonna talk to? You? Uh, who the fuck is that guy? Let's find out. It's Jeff. Good lord. All you want to, 
want, all you want is to eat in peace, and yet we're here to save the world. The the world. Look, you got the coven, and somebody else. Yeah, yeah, we know. <laughs> From you, Dimitri. Such a oh, his name is Dimitri. You wound me, truly, you do. After all I've done for you, more like done to us. What about that time you betrayed us in the middle of a, of a climactic battle? Then unbetrayed us. Then betrayed us three more times. Or that other time, the next morning, the empty bed. I'm sorry, what? Why can't they talk as separate entities so you can know which one is Porky Dimitri? <laughs> <gasps> then so be it. Then so be it. Let's end this once and for all. And not, and not like last time I said that, or the time before. This time I mean it, for real. Yeah, no, same, for real this time, once and for all. Ah, uh, this is like the seventh final battle these dorks have had this week. You've had it. <laughs> you've had it with their bullshit. You take a fistful of ketchup packets and spew them all over Demi all over Dimitri. Maybe some, of <laughs> maybe some will get on his cape and he'll run away to get it dry cleaned. What's this blood? Oh, you, oh how you wound me, my loves. I feel no pain but that in my heart. I will slink off to some cave to lay in agony between life and death, awaiting to be tended to. You spot Dimitri squeezing some of th <laughs> some of the ketchup onto the hot dog and taking a bite out on his way out to the cafeteria. <laughs> what is that dude's deal? <laughs> Truly, thank you for selfishly helping us o <laughs> on our adventure, Mimi. Nah, it was selfish. You really just want <laughs> to eat in peace, but whatever. In return, allow us to help you on one of your adventures. Man, <laughs> why not? They can go ahead and help you with solving the ancient enigma of your algebra homework or <laughs> going to retrieve the legendary bag of lasagna flavored chips from the supermarket down the street while you risk your life protecting this cafeteria table. <laughs> We've heard all of these. <laughs> We've heard tell of these lasagna flavored chips. Mostly through pl <laughs> through pleasant songs coming to us from our phones in 10 second increments. Mm. Very well, as long as you promise to guard this cafeteria table with your life. Always Wait, you. why do you need to guard this? Never mind, whatever, you helped us, so we'll help you. That's what decent people do. That's what decent people do? Pff, okay, Kevin, sure. <laughs> whatever, I bet they always try to <laughs> try to be their best slaves. Slaves, selves. Yeah. Why are they yeah. even at the they, school? Are they human? Yeah. No, they're, no, witches, they're witches. They're witches. Yeah. They're a coven of witches. All right. Here are your chips. Don't ask. Don't ask why it took so long. It doesn't matter who or who was or wasn't making out out with a near death Dimitri in the secret cave where, somewhere as his wet shirt clung dramatically to his chiseled abs and his breathing is, was ragged as he danced on the edge of life and death and a tough choice had to be made to, as to whatever as to whether to spare his life here's your change goodbye your change you didn't give them any money like on the left <laughs> well in the hurry <laughs> yo I got four dollars for that <laughs> Nice. Well, they're hurried to avoid further questions. Not that you're going to ask. You really don't care. They gave you four dollars. <laughs> Sweet deal. You got a bag of chips and four dollars. Or I got a bag of chips and four dollars. Fuck yeah. Yeah. I already choose Bussin. an activity. Uh, okay, an activity, Jason. Uh. Fucking um tennis. <laughs> Uh, I'll match it with baseball. Pog. Play orders decided based on how silly it would be if the next hottest dance move along millennials was based on mimicking this activity. I'm hitting random because both of those activities <laughs> are very <laughs> similar. <laughs> are very similar. That would be something. 
you know, do the tennis. Do the just, tennis. Like, fucking put your do hands the... together and like swing. <laughs> fucking do that the bunt. That would be a dance move. You ever seen someone bunt a baseball? Where they just hold the bat forward and let the ball hit it? Like, do the bunt. Right. Do the bunt. <laughs> Alrighty, what do we got? What we what we got working with us? Do the sponge. Uh, do the sponge sponge. Uh, do the sponge. Uh, I could dare to be a bit more bold. So I'm going to the bathrooms. That day you skipped class to hang out in the bathrooms because you respect no authority. I guess some people just want to watch the world burn by skipping class and hanging out in the bathrooms. You give zero shits, but you gain two boldness. You're minding your own business when Damien comes rushing through, punching everyone who's minding their own business. Fuck, I'm so angry. <laughs> I'm so angry I want to pull my own skull out and eat it. I'm so angry I want to set the school on fire and then punch the fire in its fucking face. I mean, when I skipped class in the bathroom, it was to do drugs. See, that's why Polly nice. would do it. That's why Polly would be it. Also, the bathrooms are outside of the school. Yeah, that's a little weird, isn't it? A little bit. I'm so angry I want to spend years... <laughs> I want to spend years acclimating political capital so I can become president and then use my nuclear codes to blow up the sun! And you, you're standing in my way. Move before I punch you so hard you'll remember my mel melancholy the times. Remember with melancholy the times when you could move without all of your bones hurting. Oh no, violence incoming. Think fast. Joke's on you, pal. I'm a pragmatist. I, I avoid any kind of idolization of the past because it has no use and therefore I refuse feeling any kind of melancholy. No time to think of anything clever. Start dancing for no reason! <laughs> He's gonna kill you. <laughs> I'm gonna do it! <laughs> so fun! I have enough fun to do it. You have no idea what to do, so, <laughs> so you just start doing a silly dance. It is l really, really silly indeed. Before you realize, all your classmates have joined you in your silly dan silly little dance. What the fuck?! <laughs> Move or I will kill you dead, you noob! Damn, Damien, you can't deny she's actually moving. Uh-huh. Well, actually... Uh, well, well, actually, involves. she you can't deny she's actually moving. Fuck, is this gonna be his voice now? <laughs> Someone's... <laughs> fucking floss! <laughs> 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 that was pretty good, yeah. That's fucking funny. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> it reminds me of the fucking, like, the uh, Fortnite is dead video where they go to put Fortnite down and the Fortnite manifestation just starts flossing to spare his life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, and quite the move she has. <sighs> Clearly, even Damien can't fight against the logic. Maybe you should move, Damien. Don't be a loser. Yeah, as, as you just said, here you move, here you move or die. Fuck, I can't even re do the voice. All your classmates start chanting, "Move or die, move or die, rip and tear." Ah! Damien, frustrated by the crazy, mindless but joyful mob you're crea you've created, finally leaves. Still, from afar, you can see an eternal fire burning in the back of his eyes. But for you, but for now, you gain two boldness and one fun. <laughs> I feel like if I had picked the other one, I would have actually fucking died. Yeah. I'm surprised I didn't. Ads. Oh. Perfect. That day, while rehearsing for the class play, you can't help but feel that you're not as good as the role requires you to be. There doesn't seem to be any ordinary way of getting yourself there, but there might be an extraordinary way. 
You summon the devil, one of many, and make a deal to enhance your creativity just a bit. Gain two creativity, but lose three years of your life as, the, as your end of the deal. But who cares? They weren't happening in the game anyway. Hey, hey Jake, darling. Ooh. It's me, lovely fan favorite, Polly. <laughs> you know, I wasn't always a ghost. Oh, oh you're going to need the penguin mask. Yeah, yeah, get, this is about to get real. Hear me out. I used to be alive, but I died with unfinished business. Now i got to live forever like this until I finish it. And you might ask, what's your unfinished business, fan favorite lovely Polly? I guess I can tell you. I never did a reverse Romanian Wilkinson. You know, sexually. <laughs> I want to know the unsexual context. She has to clarify sexually. Don't get me wrong, I love being immortal and walking through walls and shit. But my soul will never truly rest until I do that freaky sex move. Oh well. I've <laughs> done one that one loads of times. Just name it time and place and I'll reverse all over your Romanian Wilkinson. Or <laughs> throw a smoke bomb and escape while leaving a replica of yourself. That shit... That should buy you enough time to figure out what a reverse Romanian Wilkinson is. I remember this not sucking last time when I did the top options. So. Yeah. So charming. Yes! <laughs> yes, bitch! Finally someone I, as well versed in freaky sex as I am. At last, I can be free I can be free of my eternal ghostly prison or whatever. <laughs> but mostly freaky sex! All right, it's on prom night, okay? You bring you bring the supplies. I'll bring all my sex expertise. And hey, purge the zucchini, Admiral. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. See you soon. I think that's a weird way of saying jerk off. Also, my <laughs> tracking my tracking disappeared. My tracky. My tracky. Ah, why is it not working? Why is that, why am I? Oh, okay, I gotta auto calibrate. I gotta calibrate real quick. Uh, yeah. Why is my even the auto calibrate didn't work? Mm. Uh oh. Yeah, my tracking just stopped working fully. What the hell? Fuck, am I gonna have to reset it? I might gonna have to reset it. Give me a moment. I've disappeared. Don't mind me. I'm just a ghost right now. <laughs> is this actually gonna show up on stream? I wonder. It's gonna be funny if shit if it does. Like There's a lot of people being ghosts at the moment. Polly's a ghost, I was a ghost when the stream started, now you're a ghost. Yeah, everything. Tonight's just the night of technical malfunction. Ghost gang. Alright, face... There's... Finally, we can be alone, Zoom. I'm still here! And also, I'm tiny! Oh, shit. Oh shit! <laughs> Are you guys having bat. unwholesome thoughts in my chat? <laughs> no. Are you having unwholesome thoughts in my chat? <laughs> you are behind the chat. I was behind the chat. <laughs> Constantly. Yes! Alright. Yeah. <laughs> oh boy, you might have just gotten yourself tickets to the wildest night of your life. But what the fuck is a reverse Romanian Wilkinson? And what are the supplies? For now, you are at least you gain 
<laughs> at least three fun. Okay, so you're gonna literally need to be in the library every night because you're only at two money. Yep. Although uh, something happened to Jake. On Saturday night, you're at a cool pizza place that cooks pizza in a real pizza oven. Little did you expect. Oh, Damien's about to pop the fuck out of. Yep, there he is. How does that work? Can he teleport through fire? Was he? Has he been waiting inside that oven all this time just to make a kick-ass entrance? Ah, oh, the mystery. My dude, I fucking hate needing people's help, but I need. I might need yours. Don't let it get to your head, or I'll stab you so I don't have to owe you anything. Enough threats. Here's the deal, fuckhead. I might or might not feel attracted to your buddy, Mimi. You know, the one who's always making absurd choices, being equal parts stupidly sexy and sexily stupid, and with a nice booty, too. Every character I've, <laughs> I've dated says I have a nice booty. Yeah. But I don't want I mean, to get the, the, my feelings the hurt by... The look is. Yeah. But I don't want to get my feelings hurt by rushing into love without proper judgment. My dads always say, if you love someone, shoot them and see what happens. Great fatherly, ad fatherly <laughs> advice, right? Thing is, Principal Giant Spider, my therapist, and the rule, rule of law see all seem to think that shooting someone check <laughs> to check if they're the one is not very legal. They've strongly recommended that I do all that on the what they call a theoretical level, like imagining the whole thing. But imagining's for losers, and since you're both, you, and since you both know Mimi and are a loser yourself, I thought you could tell me, what would Mimi do if I were shoot, if I were to shoot her? All right, Mimi is all about getting shot. She goes the, to the doctor every day just to get a shot, and shots are the only thing she does when partying. So I think you can give her a shot. <sighs> Believe it or not, if you were to shoot Mimi, she would not be into it. Hashtag true story. You love getting shot. I do love getting shot. <laughs> I also love doing shots. Whoa, that's Tell convenient. <laughs> I have a feeling dating me. <laughs> I have a feeling dating me could increase so much chances of getting shot or stabbed. Yeah, you don't get as big as an asshole as me without making some enemies along the way. You also don't get as big as me unless you have a stroke. <laughs> I would feel bad if my loved one was to get shot because of me, but knowing Mimi is, in, is into getting shot is a relief. I fucking hate guilt. Okay, it seems like my heart isn't being a drunk idiot this time. I might be into- I might be onto something. Nice. Yeah, fucking stroke, you have a problem with it? Well, you know what helps with that? Good mac and cheese. <laughs> and who knows? If she used to- if she's so into getting shot, I might add some spice to our, to our foreplay. You know what I mean. Have you heard the sound her corpse makes? <laughs> <laughs> it sounds like that's the sound of good mac and cheese. I mean, shooting Mimi before having sex with her. Just to be clear. You f fuck you, I'm climbing up your tower. Fuck you, I'm climbing up <laughs> your tower. <laughs> your tower. <laughs> Wowie, you're welcome, Mimi. Both for getting you some demon dick. And for, for the blood loss you're about to experience, you had too much blood anyway. You gained three charm for being such a good friend. Oh, fuck, I didn't realize how little money I had. Yeah, you have $2. Challenge. Jeez. Everybody, choose something cool. Okay, choose something cool. Uh. Choose something cool, Jizum. Uh. Cowboys. Fuck, that is really cool. Uh, I'm gonna go with fire. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, BB. I don't want you. To, I don't want you for your money. This is what they said. Uh, I I'm gonna say fire. 
no, wait. I'm going to say arson. <laughs> Play order is decided based on how cool it would be if 100 years from now, humankind built a 200-foot statue commemorating the selected thing. <laughs> I think I win this one. I think so, yeah. Because a fucking 200-foot statue of arson? <laughs> That shit sounds fucking cool as hell. That sounds like fucking, what is it? Burning Man. <laughs> I suppose, yeah. It sounds like, because they built a 200 foot fucking wooden statue just to set on fire. Mm. Let's do this. Uh, guess what? Unlike the... most things, I know what Burning Man is. <laughs> Unlike these hands, you know what these hands are made of. Okay. Exactly. I'm gonna go to the class. Um, let's see. Let's see. You need ten dollar runies to get that. <laughs> let's get. Later, Gator. I got a PR agent. And remember yeah. the first rule of shop club: no refunds. I don't know what a PR agent does, but I've got one now. That day you spent some time on the library's PC playing some good old online poker. Some gambling, gambling seems like a stupid and dangerous decision. But who cares? This time it paid off, so fuck it. You gain plus two money. Oh yeah, we're in week three and promise at the end of this week. Polly is excited about trying a reverse Jeez. Romanian Wilkinson with you. Yes. And the only thing you could do <laughs> to get all the needed supplies. Which we find, except you have no idea what any of them are. Oh yes, okay, we're getting the marbles. Yeah. Luckily, you got a few spare minutes to try and figure this out. You do a quick research on your phone because you assume that the internet must know something about this. Ow. As long as it's related, related to, to weird I, sex I, fetishes. Yeah, I kicked my fucking foot. And that's why I went ow. I hit my fucking foot on something. <laughs> no, I pushed Nothing. foot. Yeah, I hit my little, my little fucking middle toe there on my left foot. The little <laughs> spiky one right there. Oh, I know. My left foot. Right down there. Is it? You see it? It's a little, it's a little swollen. I hit it a little hard. Hmm. Yeah. Nothing. <laughs> How long has Polly been a ghost? If that's not on the internet. While trying other keywords, um, you spot a spot the coven looking over at your phone. Ellipses. What? Could it possibly be they know something about the first <laughs> Romanian Wilkinson? No, they're always bitching. <laughs> they're always bitching so much about saving the world. They never admit they're into some kind of very weird sex fetishes. I, oh, I see. Oh, god damn it! <laughs> These fuckers again. Yeah, I know, right? But they're actually helping. I know, this but time. at least we, this time we get to embarrass them about sexual Maybe fantasies. You're not which is one of my favorite things to do to people that are annoying. Or maybe you're letting your prejudices blind you. There's not much more, more time you lose here. The solution is clear. You're tackling online searching in the very short-sighted way. You need to come up with uh, <laughs> you need to come up with unexpected search terms that will point you in the right direction, or use your people skills to get the three witches to admit they know what a reverse Romanian Wilkinson is and to tell you what you, uh, what you weed for it. I misread need for weed, so we're going for it. So charming! <laughs> Use your refined persuasion skills with the coven, which include techniques such as repeating, tell me what the reverse Romanian Wilkinson is to the point of exhaustion. Tell me, 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 Okay, okay, we might know what a reverse Romanian Wilkinson is. But we know because of saving the world. So you'll need a penguin mask, a bag of marbles, and a kilo of guacamole. Where's your Valerie was 
we're sure Valerie was selling a penguin mask the other day. Don't think we have a kilo of guac for you. What kind of pervs do you think we are? Surely, like, the fucking demon supermarket would. Can't I just, like... <laughs> mm. We totally have a bag of, bag of marbles, though. Where the fuck do you get the kilo of fucking ca guacamole? I have no idea. I see my. How about you up. keep the marbles and we never mention this again, okay? Okay, bye. Always gotta make it about the uh, cause we saved the world. <laughs> Nicely done, marbles, marbles. You'll never, you'll never have enough. They're perfect for booty trap, booby traps, and for super weird sex stuff. Uh, these the marbles jungle. smell funny, though. Maybe they're already used? At first you feel like that's not okay, but then again, you're about to get into some really kinky shit, so who are you to judge? Your mind is opened for, and your excitement grows. You gain two creativity and one fun. Just look it up real quick while we're doing the yeah. next thing. I'm going to go ahead and just take the first to give you time for it. Nowadays, they make flavored water because we guess people now don't know how to spend their money anymore. Player orders they spit you think water flavored like the chosen food would be. That's a funny. That's a funny prompt. What was the fucking actual pot? Uh, it's like how, how expensive would the flavor water of based around the food you got would be? Oh, <laughs> aren't they usually all like the same price? <laughs> uh, sometimes. I would go to the Slayer just, just to see for the chance of getting money from her. Mm -hmm. Because the NPC, random NPCs will give you random shit. True. Because I got the Coven gave me four fucking dollars earlier. What are you doing? You mess with me and then you try to sit at my table? Go away and get ready to die, fuckhead. You just... Eat in the corner in silence. Will you die soon? Who knows? Meanwhile, nothing else happens. And if you think this is unfair, next time, don't... Tr <laughs> if you think this is unfair, next time, don't try to sit at the table of a person who expressed his desire to murder you. Totally not a smart move. Oh what? Wait, what? I guess he's still mad about the dancing thing. Huh. <laughs> I guess Good he's job. still mad about the dancing thing. Yeah, I still need to figure out. <laughs> It'd be really funny if you get a kilo of fucking guacamole from the Slayer. <laughs> hey, what if I didn't want to talk to Damien? What if I wanted to talk to Paul? Okay, on the final night, you... Arrange, you just automatically arrange to meet a mysterious person online who's selling, selling guacamole. He turns out to be Liam. Okay. Okay, so you just need to get I a figured, I figured if one was just like a secret, it might be just kind of like Polly's like, oh, don't worry, I fucking got it. So yeah, that's kind of what I was thinking. Yeah, okay, let's go. With okay, you find Monster the Hunter. The table? <laughs> if she's even a student or what? Wait, you're choosing She's to sit? It's literally just someone trying to murder everyone. Wait, you're yeah, choosing sure. to sit with me? She's in a very nice outfit right now. Yes, oh, it's um, it's the same outfit that Polly wears when she's dressing up as quite literally anything at that one party. Yeah, it's also the same outfit that Damien wears for Hall has his Halloween costume. On your screen. <laughs> yeah. For some reason, no one ever in intentionally sits next to me. I usually have to ambush them and threaten to kill them. I wonder why. <laughs> it's a mystery. I feel like part two was led into part one there. Anyway, I'm really happy you... I mean, I'm flattered that... I mean, actually... I was expecting it to try and kill me. <laughs> uh, wouldn't give a shit about you under normal circumstances, but today I am on a quest. Yeah, that's Yes. Right. Oh fuck! <laughs> I was just play adding flavor text. Yeah, that's right. I'm not emotionally vulnerable. I'm just on the quest to slay the werewolf of Wall Street, and I yes, need a monster is. sidekick. 
Alright. Alright, you You're going to help me, obviously. I just need to know what your class is. Are you a fighter, a mage, a cleric? Out with it! Are you so... You're something much better. You're a... Asshole. <laughs> a party smith or a gun haver. I'm a gun haver. <laughs> no, you're not. You're Australian. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> a gun haver? Is that even a class? Practically everyone has guns. You reveal just how many guns you actually have. <coughs> Holy shit. How can you even carry that many guns? And why are you allowed to have them at school? You have your rad biceps, I think, for the former. And monster pro and monster pro and monster pro and monster tropolis is strong Second Amendment protections for the latter. Okay, well, do you have any? You have silver bullets. Werewolves are only vulnerable to silver bullets. Of course, I do. Man, there isn't a color of bullet that you don't have. <laughs> well, um, alright, let's uh, go on an adventure then. You travel uh, together to Wall Street where you shoot the Wolf of Wall Street with your guns. Nice. Alright then, uh, <laughs> thank you. And I'm going to go ahead and run screaming away from you if that's alright. It totally is. God bless Monstertropolis. You gain plus four boldness. <laughs> Alrighty. Here's the challenge. Everybody choose a part of their body. Body part, Jesus. My head. Because it hurts. Because that sneeze pushed me forward so fast. I'm going to go with my <laughs> my toes. <laughs> My my middle left toe right there, the one that's a little swollen because I hit it earlier. Play orders de based on how uh, how bearable it would be to live from. <laughs> how bearable it would be to live from now on with an extra unit of what of that part of your body attached to your forehead. Well, shit. <laughs> how bearable is your head attached to your forehead? Pretty unbearable, I think, Apple. Uh, I think like you uh, won. <laughs> with my little middle spiky. Especially right considering, there. actually, because it's your toe, it's yeah. like, you just look like you're some kind of, like, unicorn type motherfucker. Yeah. It doesn't even, like. It could look like just, like, some kind of wacky implant. Wouldn't even Whoa. look weird. Wacky, waving, inflatable arm flailing. You wouldn't even be like, oh, there's a human toe on your head. Oh, G Zoom. There's no what? shop. And prompts tomorrow. Cringe. A little bit. You might still get the, you might you won't get the secret ending, but you might still get the uh, yeah. not secret ending, the regular ending. Fuck. What do I do? Might as well. Might as well buff up my charm. But yeah, crunchy. In this universe, it seems that if any. Oh my god, that's sick. Yeah. I haven't really done much of the gym stuff. That day an epic yeah. dodgeball match takes place. Everything seems lost, but you deliver an inspirational speech that fuels your team's spirits. It seems like any component of the reverse... Uh, what is it? Reverse... Ra, uh, reverse... Romanian, Romanian Wilkin. Wilkinson? Yeah. Uh, a spectacular comeback. It's just like... Extremely yeah. just... Everyone's like, you fucking pervert. Despite everything else happening Everyone seems around to know you, about you're it somehow. just solving some Sudokus. But your mind is constantly Sudokus. going back to Damien. Stupid sexy Damien and his idiotic short temper. You think he could you think he could even be your sweetheart, but he seems more focused on being angry twenty four seven. For God's sake, he's the kind of guy that could get angry at a banana. Uh, he does As a matter of fact, your shit. daydreaming is interrupted by the fe feral screams of Damien, who seems to be insulting an actual banana. <sighs> you stupid yellow fruit! What's your deal? Do you think you're richer in potassium than me? <laughs> no one is richer in potassium than Damien fucking LeVay! <laughs> <Yeah! laughs> 
Is he even <laughs> for real? <laughs> Stupid sexy Damien. No, you need to put a stop to this nonsense before it escalates somehow into arson. Defend the banner defend the banana's honor or eat the banana. I'm gonna eat the banana. Eat the banana. So bold. <laughs> you get closer to Damien in a very cool and quiet way. Huh? Why do you why don't you mind your own business, noob? But you don't mind your own you don't mind your business. You eat the fucking banana instead. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah! Oh look at Damien. <laughs> He's losing his shit again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's bullying that banana. But it seems he's all bark and no bite. Not like Mimi, huh? Indeed, Mimi seems to be all bite for sure. Kinda sexy. It is alluring, being all bite and not the bullying. Bullying is never alluring, nor sexy. True that. Unless you're bullying a banana. I mean, who cares? That's just stupid. Damien is stupid. Hashtag winners don't bully bananas. They just eat them. Hashtag Damien is a stupid banana bully. God, not again! This is it. This is the last time you dare fuck with me, you bastard. On prom night, we're going to share a very special dance. Spoiler alert. It will hurt. Ooh, that's a prom fight on prom night. Damien versus Mimi. Instant classic. Interesting. I might attend. This is I feel like this is a special ending. <laughs> Damn right! You all have tickets to watch how I reduce Mimi's bones into a sad <coughs> shapeless pulp. Yes! Free tickets! Hashtag prom fight on prom night. And so you've led yourself to your own potential death. Nice. Nice. At least you gain three boldness for doing so. Your own volition. Getting beat to death by Damien ending. Let's go. That sounds sexy as fuck. Hell yeah. Everyone a pervert, huh? It sounds like the fanfic I made in middle school when I discovered that my pee pee did things when they other than pee. Wait, your pee pee does things other than pee? <laughs> Jizu. How long has this been a thing? A little while. At one point, Juan, the small Latino magical cat, uh, the small magical Latino cat slips <laughs> on a banana peel. You start to Get laugh fucked, at him. Juan. He asks you to stop, but you don't. You laugh so hard at him that you somehow steal two fun from him. Hooray! <laughs> Wait, I'm usually so nice to Juan. I'm like, hey, man, bro, it's not just about your fucking, uh, your almost all of your human traits. It's everything else as well. <laughs> and you like reminisce with them but oh my no God, did you hear they finally invented a tattoo gun that works on ghosts sweet I'm totally gonna go get it on as soon as school lets out oh shit we should definitely get matching tattoos you wanna yes of course you do what are you <laughs> what are you, responsible? The important question is, what kind of tattoo do you want to get? Uh, the entire text of the Necronomicon, so you can... You be the first half, and I'll be the second half. Knuckle tats. The, you get part... Yapar? Or... You get part Yapar, and I'll get Tiparati. Put our knuckles together... And you know what that spells? Mental deficiency. <laughs> Maybe the... I don't know. I'm going to go with the Necronomicon. Not so oh. smart. Wow. Have you heard of a little thing called cultural appropriation? Oh, fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> the Necronomicon is our book. You have no right to tattooing it anywhere on your dumb flesh. No, no, shh. I don't care if your great-granddad was a necromancer, or if you're a zombie or a Frankenstein. Right, which some of the characters are. Yeah. <laughs> Frankenstein isn't a monster, just a human doctor, but I guess so I... <laughs> but you guess it's not the best time to correct her. The Necronomicon is for ghosts and skeletons only, okay? 
<laughs> yeah, it's not. You can't say it. You have to say Necronomicon. God, I can't believe it's 2018. Fuck, you skipped that. <laughs> and the thing, I almost got a tattoo of you. Wow. Devastated, you drown your sorrows by getting by getting dang tattooed on your chest. It looks. It's not a good look. You lose two charm and one fun. <laughs> Dang. That's, so, that's kind of All fucking right. hilarious. I Monster think prom draw nears. Who, who are we going to ask? We are going to ask Damien. Because we're going to fucking die. Hey, All right. Might as well go with Polly. Hey, Come on, bro. I didn't mean anything by it. All right. Here we go. The whole run <laughs> is ruined now. It can be. That's what's really funny about that. You really pluck up your courage and ask your beloved <laughs> to go to the monster prom with you. Prom with you? You dumb fuck! That's a fucking great idea! <laughs> Are you sure? <laughs> Are you sure? Are you some kind of genius or something? I'll tell you what you are. My date to the prom! Prom night was crazy intense. At one point, a classmate of yours criticized how Damien is always getting into fistfights. For which Damien punched him, starting yet another fistfight. You joined in and fought him, <laughs> fought with him back to back. It was you a super sexy photography so. fight. <laughs> and you even exchanged trusting glances while watching each other's backs. <laughs> and that was the only time... That was the only... <laughs> That wasn't the only time that night you took care of Damien's rear. Wink. <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> Fucking that sister too. Stupid bitch and dumbass. <laughs> Problem with a stupid bitch like you? Who the fuck else could I go? Would I go with dumbass? Exactly. I love it. All right, Jake from State Farm. You pluck up your courage and you ask your beloved. <laughs> Here we go again. Prom night. <laughs> Yes! Yay. He actually got her. You seem like kind of the person that we could both end up. <laughs> we could both have us both ending up in the hospital. Nice. Which would be impressive because she's a. Yeah. Is that the kind of unnecessary danger I like in my afterlife? <laughs> Let's go. It's time to make some wild and poor life choices. Cut it. Prom was wild! Let's but, fucking go. But still not enough for the likes of you. So you, so close to dawn, you decided to keep partying by improvising a dope after party at an abandoned manor house. Of course. You partied with a group of classmates for days. Over time, people came and left. Some even died from too much partying. At one point, one of the deities of partying hard appeared, summoned by the deaths of your peers, which turned out to be a sacrifice to him. <laughs> he declared you as you his heralds and bestowed upon you supernatural rad party powers, like endless confetti, whatever that means. <laughs> then he joined you and you all kept partying for another entire week because that's how you roll. Fuck right. yeah. Fuck it. So we got Mimi, most likely to survive for a year drinking only her own pee. And yeah. then Damien, <laughs> sexiest horn. <laughs> Alright, we got nine new events and ten new outcomes. Fuck it, those gauges are barely even full. Mm. Three weeks is maybe the most epic, absurd weeks of your lives. Monster problem, we kept living our lives, falling in love, battling for... Okay, let's see where everybody went. Damien became a, re a renowned drag racer until he died in the most badass way during a race. At I the thought funeral, his death was supposed to involve dolphins. Uh, bottle nose dolphins, I know, right? At the funeral, you spotted, <laughs> him, you spotted him hidden among the crowd. He winked at you. Polly graduated from doing lots of... Okay, we've read this one before. Miranda used her vast knowledge of surfs to get a job handpicking the best surfs for other people. Unsurprisingly, she ended up leaving her surfs to do the work. For those three weeks, the monster prom seemed larger than life, and then it was gone. Just like that. So Damien faked his own death. That, that's, a, <laughs> that's fucking funny as shit. Yeah. Dude, Michael Townley moment.
Michael Townley. That's my man. <laughs> yeah, I like this song. I like that picture of Polly right there. Zoe, which one? Fucking, oh, the yeah. one where she just got leaning on top of Liam. I love the one where they're eating the hot dogs. I just yeah. realized it's got the interdimensional prince holding a sign that says "Marry me." <laughs> <laughs> I have love seen that. Gonna have to look at that here in a minute. We both got a date. I wonder if there's gonna be two Polaroids. Maybe. Player ch. <laughs> I could just I like the radioactive barrel that says prank juice. I didn't even realize it was radioactive last time. Yeah. <laughs> this is prank juice. Oh, that's a new picture. Which one? The one of Zoe taking picture. Oh yeah. It's very good. Special thanks to Stumped Gamers. Super Beard Bros. I know that show. I used to watch it. As Alex Falciani and the uh, Gerard Dragon Rider Khalil. Oh man, Polly's giving your character the good feel right there. Oh, <laughs> no better distraction. It's I so I got the poly picture for that. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Unlocked seven new images in the gallery. I wonder if I wanna see if I got one for doing for Damien. Alright, so we unlocked Damien's basic ending. Alright, so Polaroids. All right, let's see. Here, here's the one we were talking about. Oh, it does just say "Marry Me." Yeah. All right. <coughs> and then right there, the fucking pranks you. Good job securing the sex plus drug addiction. Nah, babe, I'm proud of you. know what the one's fair. Thank you. You know that one's fair. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, let's see. Okay, here's a new one. Here's the new one. Oh man, I only got the Polaroid of you and Polly. No better distraction. Yeah, I talked to you. But that's okay, because I don't want to have to go after her again. <laughs> she always seems to elude me. Although I I do have to do the reverse Wilkinson. Which is an alternate ending. Cool. Yeah, yep, the Damien one didn't get unlocked. Maybe there's not a Damien one. For the... I feel like I just fucked you. Oh, well. I don't know. It's weird. It's also the first game where we've gotten multiple people. Uh, where multiple people have gotten a date to the Brom. Yeah. Okay, so... Here's, like, alternate artwork of the characters. Like the two player characters and then Liam and Polly. Polly looks more oh, like yeah. a slime than a ghost in that one, though. This has been fun. Oh, we got we got some concept art of the night, the flaming night guy. Nice. It sure says, oh my god, bull. School cool. Alright, we got new fan art. And, oh, it's Polly. Oh, it's really good, too. Look at that. 
mid set. That's a mid. Ooh. Yeah, it's really I good. It. I like it a lot. Alrighty. <laughs> I was like, this someone is going to die of fun. Yeah, that's why they're together on the table all the time. That's just, they're the someone that's going to die of fun. Yeah. Into, uh... Alrighty. So let's go and raid someone real quick. Because I'm kind of done for the night. We got four hours stream in, though. So that was good. We had a good night. Jeez. Who's live right now? Oh, Rikori's playing Rise. Let's go raid Rikori. Uh, slash raid. All right, you guys know the deal. If uh, we got we go in there, we got Apple raids and we got good boys in chat. Bye, Crunchy. All right, here we go. Raid now.